long okay all right I had headphones on should be chilling ideally okay all right all right then just check mail nothing of no okay find a nice spot to roll we're gonna not that yet. But Candace's. That's the one thing I managed to do last time. Try out all these trials to get every single measly roll I can scrape up in time. <sighs> okay. Alright. I. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Thank you. Thank you. This is just pure chaos. No problem at all. I'm just glad he can make it. Good to see you again. Uh, take your time. I think in the future, I'm going to have to make... Oh, notice of the fact. Might have to set things to nine. Because I can't rely on work to actually end on time. <laughs> okay. Chori. Make this happen. See, let me see. Some Tomoto. That's decent. That Ningguan, Bennett, Bennett, Zhongling, and this is decent. Yeah, let's go through and blast you. Sayonara. And I. Oh, that was the wrong amount of Tomotos. Oops, I forgot to put this back, because right, no constellations. Oops. Okay. Whatever. I... Cooldown's annoying. Thank you. And that sends that away. And we're gonna spin. Alright, and it's cool. Oh, right. I actually forgot about that aspect of Chiori's kit. Well, whatever, it worked. Okay, we'll try out Shunin real quick. I wonder, right, and this is one of those open world trials. Right, okay. Let's check that then. <laughs> Roar blades, swift moving and climbing. Yeah, not so points. And okay, that's for Pyro and okay, that's a very standard team. All right. Just want to shred that Pyro then, but of course, first we want to let you in. She sounds just like Joel and Cujo. To be fair, it's the exact same voice actress, but still. Okay, and how much until that cools down? Just a few seconds, and Pyro would be a good one to shred here. Let's make this happen, and let's crystallize that. There, nice. Thank you. And, well, that wasn't really a problem, and that shredded the Pyro, too. Okay, cool. Thanks. And the crystal is there are not really an issue. Let's make this happen and get that back. Start some climbing. Oh boy. Oh goodness. And we can Right, you have to jump to get that going, and that's not bad. Let's sprint, keep on sprinting, and you're right over here. Hello. Try this one more time, and actually, well, that also kind of works. Ah, nice, you can get that started using the Nightsoul transmission too. That's really good in not one. Okay, and if it works, it works. Okay, oh, not a lot of particles though. Huh, get back to you, get that back, and it's over there. I think I probably want to do a few fights as well. That'll be okay. So, how many opponents are going to show up over here? Huh. Well, whatever. And once that shows, we'll... Thanks, and... Get that going. Put that away. It is a little... Not necessarily clunky, just... Kind of confusing at times, and... There we go. Bless that. And thank you. Keep on hitting. That shred is real nice to have. And oh, look, it's you. Hello. And. Mm, I think. 
Shilinet will be a good option here. Back into those source samples. Thank you. Cool, just like that. And oh goodness. And I. There we are. And one more of you clowns. And nice. Keep hidden. And mm, not good at actually guaranteeing those vaporizes, but whatever. And there we are. Completed that. And now it's time to roll. Oh, good and done. See how many rolls I can get in. Get this done. Come on, come on. Exit that level. Hmm. Good stuff. Okay. So how much do I got right now? I got three seven five one five, which means we're at four pity on that banner. It's just math. That's two hundred then. 40. 241, 246 with those fates, so it shouldn't be a huge problem. Let's go over. Her workshop is somewhere. Her workshop is right around this way, so I'll just go over there. And that's where I'll roll. Got <clears throat> all the not on characters who currently exist in the party right now. That said, I will need to fight her boss a bunch to actually get her up to cruising speed. <clears throat> Do have a partially leveled Cinder City set for her as well. She's definitely a fat sword user. Okay. So, this is where we gotta go. Gotta sorta. Huh. This is her workshop. Pick these up just for fun. Additionally, I could also get to maximum rep here as well, with all the traps currently available. Either way, I think it's time to roll. That pity counter back up. Okay. Oh no, that's 50. 50. Refer oh, hi! Hello! Came just in time for rolls. Let's get started, I suppose. Takes us to 14. Yeah, yeah. Suppose so. Let's check. See if I lose 50 50 this time. I'm pretty sure I've got everyone. Okay, that's Candace, who we already had. Okay. Now, everyone right now, I think maybe except for Koi. I should check. Should have everyone at Max Cons. Yeah, yeah, we got Max Cons on everyone, so maybe a decent amount of Star Glitter. We'll see what happens. Okay, 24. And another purple. Come on. That's... Oh, a sack ball? That's not bad. Okay, 34. And more purple. That time it was okay. Koli and Dorian, that's more star glitter. Okay, fair enough. 44. Another purple. Uh, this time it was. Okay, another Candace, who already again had C6. It's kind of funny that in a certain sense, Candace C6 is a new Bennett C6. Because Candace is a great Milani teammate, except at C6. Anything below C6, she's a great teammate. Because with C6, she applies Hydro of her own, and that gets rid of Milani's vapes. Okay, so 64. And, okay, more purple. Right. Hmm. That, okay, another Koi. Again, not really important. 74. Already had her C6. And, really? More purple. Uh, see how deep in we need to go for this. And Oh, Chevy Con. Unexpected Chevy Con. That's pretty nice. Okay, let me see what that puts me at for her, actually. Before I go in and do anything else. Hmm. Okay, that's... Aha! Uh -huh, that's the one that lets her shoot more times. After burst, which isn't incredibly crazy because I you don't build Chevy for damage, but cool. That gets you one closer to C6, which is very good. This one that lets her get more Electro and Power bonus. 75. Okay, well. We're going in deep. Okay. 76. 
Frequency and another purple. Okay. And that's... Okay, more coaling. Well, that's good amounts of star glitter, at least. We're getting good amounts for crowns and etc. Emphasis on the etc. 78. Mm -hmm. 79. And there's our gold. Is this gonna be? And it's... Oh, there we go! We got her. Okay, cool. That's it. 79. So I'll tap that in. Okay. There we go. Nice. So not too far in. That's 79, which isn't all that bad. Let's put that in. Zulanen at 79. 10, 11, 24. Okay. Cool. So it's time to start leveling her up. <laughs> Cool. Close that off, put that back to zero because we're at zero again now. So I guess all those saved up Prima gems are going to Chaska now. All right. So, we had a bit of battle pass for all the rolls we did. Do a bit of more enhancing. We'll see. Okay. And level up her a little bit, but mostly I'm going to need to find that new boss a bunch. Either way, Aoi has been holding her Cinder City set. And that's... All oh, those are going to be around 15. Okay. So she's built for maximized defense, plus a bit of healing bonus. That's all good. And of course Cinder City, because that allows her to <clears throat> boost up. Bunch of stats for most people. Give a bunch of damage bonus to everyone. Just see. Okay. See how much of the Archon quest I actually end up being able to do today. We'll see what happens. Okay, we got that there. And could try boosting that up, but I'll get some trash artifacts fighting the new boss as well. Either way, let's... Sorry, Kachina, you're getting replaced with someone who is literally just you, but better. In most relevant ways. Okay, Shilana, no dual blade. We want you to have a fab sword. And it... Got a couple ones that I should be leveling. This one is kind of crap, but this is max refined. I should get that to 90. Eventually. Okay... Okay, because that's not as much ER. Uh, this is actually... This should be okay for now. She doesn't need a crazy amount of ER, actually. She should already be in a good place ER-wise. So we can stick with that and level that eventually. And I do have... Once I'm able to actually... Oh, well, her talents are more than enough for that, too. So in that case, I'm going to go over to the teapot. The peapot. And... Put her in in place of somebody who has overstayed their welcome. Okay. So Emily does not need to be here right now, unfortunately. And anything new? Oh, we got new furnishings. Okay. Well, there are other kinds of wood I need to. And nice to buy these at the same time, but whatever. Okay. Lots of... There's food. Lots of hats. Huh. Need one hat. Lots of furnishings. Okay. Llama statue. I mean, puppet, apparently. Come on. Phlogiston. Oh, there are actually Phlogiston items. Oh my goodness, there's actually a crazy amount here. Well, that means probably not buying all the shop items next week, but whatever. Okay, there we go. Cool. So, in that case, time to go blow up her robot a bunch of times. Okay. Goodbye, Emily. Okay. Then I put in Shilinen, because it's only Kinij and Shilinen out of the characters I have who aren't at 10, because I keep that in the party for comms. Okay. So, really, right now, it's 
That's where the new boss is. It's around here. A thousand grotto secret source automaton configuration device. Ancient machine used for manufacturing. It is said to be a production machine produced by a long lost ancient civilization, as it can be both a tool and a weapon. It is far more dangerous than most other secret source automaton warriors. Okay. So we'll go in that tiny little cave where the only thing of note is really just that boss. Okay. And Shilinen can be in there because you actually need to do a bit of climbing for that boss. Actually, do a single ascension. Music is playing. Okay. Here we go and see what that town is. Yeah. Okay, so all she does is just meow. It's hilarious. Okay. Pick that up then. To see for her. So that portable armor. No, no. Source samples. Elemental types change, and that's that's the only way to actually max out the source samples. Yeah. Generate them. Yeah, because you cannot actually activate the other source samples at all unless you've ascended her at least once. Okay. Oh, whatever. We got a crazy amount of whistles. That's not a problem at all. So we can go down under this bridge and find her boss. And as of right now, it's just her who fights it. Cool. And this little chasm was not open last patch. Actually, apparently you could get down in here. It was just blocked off normally. Okay. Cool. Go in. Should be a teleport waypoint around here. That Pyroculus is actually above. It's not newly accessible this patch. Okay. Let's check this again. That's... Oh, right. We have all of these to pick up. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for finishing blueprints. Cool. All right. So in that case, let's activate this teleport waypoint so we can find this boss. And it is absorbing for Gistin right now. Good for you. Okay, so Night Souls of Blessing will activate its state, in which we need to basically climb up and break some things. Hello there, hello. Secret Source Automaton, Configuration Device, Ancient Ruins Constructor, Machine with Terrifying Destructive Capabilities. When characters enter and maintain the Night Souls of Blessing state, the Secret Source Automaton Configuration Device will start progressing through its adaptive countermeasures. Once those are complete, this configuration device will start preparing its Bolt Sphere Cannon. During this time, the configuration device will start up its accretion mechanism to dig in a solid Fulgistin and collect Fulgistin. The accretion mechanism will generate an energy field, so you have to actually climb up into that. So you need Kachina or Shilinen, and of course Kachina is free. If you wish to destroy the mechanism and interrupt the charging of the Bolt Sphere Cannon, or you could just find a way to grapple up or fly up. This first climb the solid Fulgistin, which only a Tepet with Soros, which aren't around here, or Kachina, or that's why Kachina is right here, or Shilinen can climb. Okay, cool. So there you go. Cool, and let's let Milani do this, do some damage, that Night Soul up, come on, come on, maintain that Night Soul, and fusion should be soon, okay, and there we are, nice, that means we can start that up, go ahead, start your accretion, dig into that solid Phlegiston, Come on, there we go, and there we are. Bring her close range, not a bow, can break the mechanism, interrupt its charging. Okay, and break that, there we go. Has the moon come up? It takes some damage from that, too. Well, the secret source automaton configuration device is showing its bolts for your cannon, break the accretion mechanism, and interrupt the process. There we go. Okay, alright. So let's actually put Dia down. It should have a lot less resistance now. Okay, cool, and just like that. Good stuff. And last one. Shoot. And okay. Shoot and one more should be possible. There we go. And well, we'll need to try this again, it seems. Alright. Well, it hasn't have to be repeated too many times. Let's keep up that nice little blessing. Oh, that's annoying damage. And there we are. Cool. Alright. This. It's not actually. It is kind of tough. At the very least, I'm using a team with all the characters you need. Uh, bonuses right now, so... 
the friendship right now, so that does complicate things a little, and there we go, nice. Damage that deals is actually rather capable. Thank you, and shoot. To be fair, Milani is probably the best at taking advantage of these damage windows. Kinich can just be for actually maintaining, and that's what's blessing. She only just needs that power application of vape, really. Okay, cool. Here we go. First kill. Time to do at least... Oh, at most 15 more. Shouldn't take all that long, though. Golden Scribe Secrets First Core. It's, again, basically a microprocessor. This is a core component that's separated from the body of a Secret Source Automaton configuration device that lost its ability to move after being defeated. Some say that the cores that power all of the Secret Source Automatons are actually the same kind of device, that they simply carry different information as attested to by the fact that the golden patterns on them are different. First, the many commands were only added to the circuits in the smooth running, but it seems that all the superimposition and layering of orders onto one another has wound up creating a rudimentary artificial intelligence. Alright, that... not good enough. Okay. So, we can come back in a minute. Let's ascend you one more time, just to give you a bit more durability. Cool. Alright, but that would also boost... Melanie's damage. That is also true. Of course, there's a shred bonus we need to kick in as well. Okay. Okay. Huh. Let's try that out. Grab all of these just a little. It does also increase her blade roller damage. Not all that relevant though. Oh! I like that new interface. That increases the res shred by. Not all that much, but given that the shred is tiny right now. It's meaningful. Okay, cool. So we can pop back. Spending more, uh, yeah, lots of that. Okay. Cool. So we can teleport back in after a brief heal to spawn the boss back. And then that'll be... It's the only thing I couldn't actually pre-farm for them. Actually pre-farm for her. Everything else I could pre-farm. Not that. Okay. Boss materials are boss materials. And there you are again. Hello. Okay. And to be fair, we're not actually really trying to do damage here, so... Let's try to maintain Night Soul some way, and... Should be enough time to just... Contain that Night Soul, and... Oh, oh, never mind. That's actually not working. Well, that... Uh, Night Soul Transmission for Sheelan, and we'll kind of do the trick there. Okay, so that combination of his interval and transmission should be good, and then I bet maybe if I did things right, Milani could actually totally shred. We'll see what happens. And hit that. Thank you. Thanks. Break that, and we can put Milani in to take that, and then we actually just do that normally, and... Alright. Activate those source samples. Two, three, right, and mm, it's not bad, but it's not crazy. Mm. Okay. Cool. And one more shot. Ah, uh, okay. Alright. Thank you. Burning. Sure is that. And I... Oh, well, if you die, you're dead. Alright. Oops. Forget how absolutely squishy he is. Okay, and we can use that too. Crap. Okay. Poor Kinich. Okay. So two times is more or less what we need. No matter what. I can't speed it up by all that much. And Kinich is fragile enough that I should actually try to keep it out of the line of fire. Okay. Cool. And one, two. And just like that, we can put Milani back in. Come on, and that's not bad. As long as we have Cinder City, we're chilling. It's all about getting something that actually works with Witsith, because attack bonuses are literally nothing for her. Alright. And we've got enough for another Ascension. Okay, that's not very good. Okay. Okay, cool. Well, time to burn a bunch of transient resin to uh, get her to 90. That's okay. Come on, Kinich, do not die. Try that out. Red Shred actually will help, too, in the phase, because when it's not stunned, it has vastly increased her res as well. Okay. 
Should be it so you can claim another. Okay. And just upgrade those talents so we can do that a few more times. Got more than enough of everything. Okay. Good, at least it's fast. Okay, increase that trend, and right now it's a pretty nice amount. Okay. Increase that damage and the healing. It is interesting that even though the fallout beats are exactly the same amount of damage as the skill damage, it's still a separate indication. Okay. Alright then. Continue with healing. Yeah, not bad at all. Okay, let's get some more kills in. Hope we get some four rolls. Because otherwise it's 16, probably 15. You only need one four to get that 15. Let's see what happens. Which damage we can deal while the Night Soul is active. Okay, and one, two, three. All right. On to end. Just Milani moment. Milani moment. Nice and bulky in a way that the other ones are not. Okay, and just another. Okay, there we are. And, well, that missed. Okay, whatever. Okay. Go ahead. We will break your stuff down. Come on, come on. And we got it. Thanks. Slash. Up. And cut it. Thank you. Put in you. Nice, nice. And shoot. Oh, goodness. Shoot. Shoot. And last one. Shoot. And. Okay, well, no fit hit. Sad. And use this for a little bit more. Come on. Oh, well. That's a bit painful. And. Running that will get some too. Well, now we can try that again. Break it out one more time. It is pretty darn bulky. I find it interesting that it is an Electro boss, considering that the normal Secret Source Automatons are all pyro. Okay, cool. And that will finish it. Well, actually, we could just send in you again. You don't have that long of a... Yeah. You don't have much of a cooldown. He is just in here to collect friendship, I suppose. Okay. Transit. And no space left. I need to clear a good amount out then, probably. That's okay. Uh, uh. I, we will save that. So we've actually beaten her boss as many times as we need. Uh, okay. Thank you. And... At least the minimum you can get is three. Okay. It's not very good. Again, that said, we should toss a number of those in the artifact printer. Can do that. Okay. What am I willing to part with? That is not that good. So not that good. Also, not very good. That's pretty crap. Getting rid of all the... Crap, and turning it into artifact juice. Okay. It's been a while since I used any of these. That is actually good. I don't need that to be. I don't want to throw that one away. Crap. Crap. Pretty crap. That. Also, yeah, crap. Garbage. Pretty bad, too. And that. Yeah, I just can't really afford to hold on to gladiator pieces most of the time. Okay, let me see. What else might I be willing to part with? That's good, actually. At least get those out of the inventory. Okay. Higher levels, well, yeah. We gotta. Still need a bit more for that, that's okay. Uh... My, just so I can afford to clear stuff up. Just need to make sure I've actually made the juice by the end of the patch. Stuff I do need to toss. See what happens. Of course, I don't want to accidentally trigger the Archon quest, so... Let's just pick that up there. Because the Archon quest gets triggered by approaching that Adventurer's Guild. I should actually be able to make 
do a few more runs now though because I cleared those out of the inventory but put the trap through at least okay and we don't need that many more standard crystals do we we really don't okay so time to kill this boss again it does seem that Milani Dia is going to be the way to go here just in general Shionen is generally just very good for Milani Right, that's the EM right there, and send you through, and nice, and take that going, and right soul, very nice soul, and I did actually manage to avoid that by jumping, which that's fun, and there we are, actually pretty capable damage with that. It said Milani is taking damage as well, and I don't like that part. All we can really do right now is stay out of the way. All right, and let's get this going. And let's consume it for this and now. All right, and get yeah, through. And slash that up. Thank you. Cool. And nice. Crystal is the right element. Cool. Make sure we get that crit. And nice. And blast again. All right. Hmm. Let's see who I can keep in. We can just try our best to. Oh, that damage is frightening. Just to maintain that blessing. So he's got a bit of use there then. Let's transition because Moni's Night Soul is going to last a little longer than that damage interval. Okay. So he's got his place. To an extent. Okay. Fusion mechanism and. Nice. That dash actually worked really, really well. And slash slash and do the samples and get that shred in. Oh, Cinder City should be good and very, very nice. Okay. There we are. Oh, we got four that time. Good. Make sure that that's a crappy Electro Goblet. Do you need a bit of healing? Okay. Either way, I should have more than enough to Fragile Resin to get you in it to 90 with what I have. <sighs> but just basically being a faster moving and climbing Kachina is fun to have. Kachina was good enough already. Glad that I left a bit of the Children of Echoes to explore with her. Okay, just to make sure I get as much damage as I can out of all of this. And thank you. And all right. Cool. And Milani moment. And... And just get that going. And I, oh, I couldn't quite jump that in the way I would have wanted. Okay, one more and... Cool. Take that, and here we are. Gotta wait for your little attacks, and then you gotta put down the mechanisms. You need to dig up the Soul of Fugistin, which I guess you're sort of vacuuming out of the ground. It's interesting how that happens, and if we can just jump to the other side. Well, we didn't dash that time. Oops. Okay, and toss that down. Thank you. Yeah, that source sample activated. And keep on smacking. Like the wood is a bit annoying, but it's all about that crit. Cool, and let's hit. Nice. And good damage. And we need you to stay out of the way. Nice. Okay, and that actually did not hit. Good stuff. And that's Night Soul. Good. Okay. So. Give me a second. Get this going. Bring that back. Okay, transmission up. And dash. And I, I did that wrong. Okay. Oh, and that damage was more than enough there. And cool. And that vape in at Milani. Just... Go for one, that will be enough in another lot. Cool. Punish that with transient. Cool. And more of that. We got enough for another level. That's another crap. Okay. Let's ascend. Oh, we need we need more geo crystals. That's right. Okay. This it's an interesting boss. It's smart that it requires Kachina more or less to interact with its stun mechanism. Which you can get for free. We can also just skip straight to that one Archon Quest during this patch anyway, because I was gonna say you can get her for free, but only through the Archon Quest, which you might not have access to. But as of right now, you can 
until since now, I presume you can strip, skip straight to not one AQ. That's right. Let's make more Geo Crystals, because we're not getting any Geo Crystals from shielding in right now. I mean, from that boss, because it's an Electro boss, so another way of encouraging you to roll for more characters. We have none of those right now, so we need to make 18 more of these. Not bad, again, because it's just fight so many bosses for everyone, really. Okay, we get six. That's how many we need. Cool. All right, then. Allow me to continue ascending her. That does mean that also boosts the Night Soul Burst when she maxed out her Night Soul points, which is also good. Boost her a bit more, and she said something there. We'll check everything at the end. Okay. That's it. 16 dead now. Nice. Okay. So all there really is to do is just kill that robot. Well, scrap that robot, I suppose. Might be a bit more accurate. A few more times. Okay. As a result, Toyok is actually a bit higher than it was before because I activated that teleport waypoint. That's right. And that... And I, yep, leveled. Cool. She needs 12 in total for this next level. It's the final couple that always require the most. All right. Well, that, to be fair, we could just have her do the healing. That is right. And thank you. And jump out of the way. And try to, oh, well, we got stuck. That's annoying. And I, well, can I hit that? Gotta go in the air a little. That's fine. Mm -hmm. But it's really actually more about Night Soul Points. That said, we could obviate the need for the statue by just having her do the healing. That is true. Thanks, and jump. Yep. Oh, we can jump all the way over. That is really useful. Okay. And Milani. See how long that gets with the bonus last. That is really, really good. Let's go take Rit. And, oh goodness. Soldier should help as well, and if this does, and mm, not as much as I might like. That's okay. And just keep on staying away from that. It's all about activating that, so I don't even really need to do damage here, but it's fun when you do. Okay. Come on, I want to see if you could probably get it to die by falling. If you got it to a really precise interval. That could be fun to try. Okay, and go up, and dash jump all the way over. Good stuff. And one, two, thank you, and oh, I bet if I had actually like key HD damage there. Much to think about. Fragile, okay. And there we go, more that's that's crit, but it's not even good. That's what's really sad. Even crit isn't always good. Okay, and we gotta teleport a bit farther away. We can't just teleport right outside. Let's sort of do a little teleport jig. Okay. Oh, wait, it. Oh, we really gotta get done. Okay. I want to see if you can get it to die by crashing down. That would be really, really fun. And we get you in, and yeah. Thank you, Milani. And bite that, and two, three, and that still hit me, but not all that much. Good stuff, and another hit. There we go, cool. Let's wait for that. Actually, in the meantime, we could try to get a few hits in. Maybe. Yeah, we could try to maximize the damage dealt before it breaks down. Yeah, that is a good idea, maybe. And just jump it. I, ooh, that was fun. Did not intend to actually do that plunge, but it worked just fine. And there we go. Put that out. Send Milani one more time. Cool. Right, and I... Mm -hmm. That's interesting. How much damage we can deal, and... How much is this going to deal now that we've gotten back? And Well, that just, that just killed straight up. Okay. I probably should have waited. As we could have tested whether the crash could have killed. It's just three again. Okay. That could be a good EM off piece, actually. 
Well, let's heal. Okay, nice. And that... That's okay. I like the sound effect for that. Yeah, good healing. Also, there are two local legends I'd like to fight as well. Nice. Her healing ain't bad. Not half bad. <clears throat> Which is why she's presumably an upgrade for new Viet teams. I do want to check. really want to see if we can get that kill by dropping. That'd be fun. Alright. Getting close. Did that happen? And... Oh, well. Thank you. And... One, two. Let's just... Keep fighting. Mm -hmm. Should get another instance where we can try to get up in, if at all possible. And there we go. Thank you. And... Shoot. Nice. And... Not all that complicated. We're going in the right direction. And, well, there we go. Cool. This should hopefully be enough, depending on our interval. Damage amount, and we go over, jump, and get that. Nice. Bonnie, thank you, and oh, that did not quite work. Thanks, and yeah, yeah, and Moani. Two, three, let's go for the crits, and mm, even Center City couldn't do it all. Oh, I don't think we actually got that in direct correctly. Maybe, and... Okay, now we the UN and I oh we don't have any pyro in. That's kind of annoying. So let's try to see how many shots we can get in before that goes. And I ah oh, we just missed that barely. This should hopefully be enough damage to get a kill from crashing down. It's in a very interesting position right now. Yeah, I, okay. Let's put you in. Get that going. And Rush over and hit, and it can die by just breaking the Phlegiston mechanisms. You can get it to crash down to its death. There you go. All right. No space left. Okay. Okay, we got our upgrade. Shunan's artifacts bitten. That's right, we can also level these. Okay. Cool. Let's boost that damage ever so slightly. Cool. So that was interesting to confirm, and the shred is only getting better and better. Healing is also getting better and better, and now it's another ascension needed for a level. Okay. Right, right, right. Let's toss them into the Cinder City pieces. Okay. It's an okay amount. How many more we need to get rid of? Don't want to use those right now. Until I absolutely have to. Cool. And there we are. Another one. Probably want some healing it and just... I barely missed that. And that's crit EM. Crit EM, I don't think I can let that go. Do that for healing. Cool. Not bad at all. Thank you. We will teleport away. So we need... Seven more kills. In terms of artifacts... Yeah, as long as we use them when they told us to burn them. Wouldn't have to worry about going over cap and having to actually juice a bunch. Probably should juice them before tomorrow. That's not all that interesting, frankly. Let's see what happens. Okay, and we send in you. One, two, three, and Dia. And Milani can do it. And alright. Let's get that damage up as much as possible in the time we have. And this is probably Kinich time, actually. Yep, that to maximize the damage as much as possible. That's you. We gotta keep that burning up. Cool, and two, one, and shoot. That very nice. So now we just wait for that. Nice. And hit that. Jump over. And there we go. Nice. You in. Send it in Shu and N to get that in. Try that one more time. Thank you. One. Mm, lack of crit is hurting. Shred is good, but I there we are. And now it's time for Kinich. 
Come on, and I... Mm, sending the missile does increase his ability to actually handle that burning, which isn't a crazy issue, but still. And there's our crash kill. Okay, cool. Let's pop that. Yeah. <clears throat> I do like the fact that it doesn't just leave it at 1 HP, like... Oz does, for example, if you kill, uh, hit Oz uh, while he's in his invulnerability period in his free form in phase 3, just can't do it. And so let's... Oh no, we miss. We gotta get closer. Okay, there we go. And just get a bit more. Cool. And we get ascend one more time. Create a little bit more damage and shred out of that. Yeah, the kills are getting faster and faster because she went in support abilities are getting better and better. Okay, that's that final blue faint, too. We could just send those all through now if we wanted. Okay, I think I should be able to get her to max, but we'll see. Alright, claim that. That's... And the music stopped. How sad. Oh, I do need to get a bunch more gold whistles crafted. That's right. Let's go back again to the other crafting bench so I don't pop the quest accidentally. And here we are. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, I... 30... It's 4, 6, 12, 36. How many we get at least? Is that 42? 8, then... 26... 66 or so, I believe. Left. Okay, and we need 72 then. What happens when I kill Safo every day for her whistles? Okay. Any four more should be fine. If we get any excess, that's good. Okay. So, there we have it. Let's level her skills up just a bit. Okay. And there we are. Got all of those mirrors. Mirrors of me. Okay. Keep that healing up and to get the final few upgrades, we'll need to boost her up. 10 might actually be worth it eventually because that does boost her shred. But I'd need to do a bit more farming for that. Okay. Either way, we can go back down and get the few remaining kills we need because we need... Six more kills should be enough. No doubt about that. Don't get four a lot, but guarantee of three is still really, really nice. Okay. So every little bit of boosted damage helps pretty significantly, too. So let's try this out, put you through, and one, two, get down, and two, three, and get that, and I... Mm, Gotta tank that hit, not that bad, but still gotta tank it, and there we go, nice stuff, and keep on shooting, get that burning up, and cool, burn, 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 and shoot again, and shoot, okay, cool, get a little bit of extra damage in while we wait for that to come, okay, thank you, and we just gotta dash over, and get that, Okay, cool. And she went in. One, two, and Dia. And now you. And then Hydro in. And good damage. Very good damage. Thank you, I. This is nice. Look at that crit, and the missile will finish you off. Yep, there we go. And it comes out. It comes out hard. Okay. And Soul just a three. So five more runs, pretty much either way. If we got four every time. Uh, just before, but I'm not counting on that. Okay. Alright, so let's teleport back. Only five more runs. And I think there's a little bit. Only 2% more for Kawada Pack, and then I can collect their rewards for that. And then I can do bounties for all my people, Springs and Children and Echoes, and get them all the max rep. Right now, actually. And I think two more Night Soul Totems I need to do as well. So I probably won't get much in the Archon Quest done. But I d would want to max out their Totems. And all the Night Soul Totems before any of that anyway, so... Yeah. 
Alright, and... One, two, three, because you gotta do three if you do it like that, right? Okay, nice. Also gets a Night Soul in, which is nice too. It's a Night Soul, and... For that, well, she still took the hit. Whatever. Okay, and we can try that out. Nice, shoot, and... Mm -hmm. Shoot that, and... We'll see how many we can get in. We can guarantee that shot a bit more by doing the jumps. Okay, cool. And... She went at transmission. So we can still use her for buffing. And get that there. There we go. Thank you. And that's not all that useful. Nice. And do that in. Thank you. Get that pyro on. Mm, still not that impressive. Sad. And let's try to go for a shot. And pray for a crit. Still not all that impressive again. And give it. Okay, it's all about maintaining the night soul though, not about the damn well that did not help. Oops, probably should have gotten that healing in. Still need to go back to the statue then and use that to activate there. That is fine, I suppose. Crash won't kill this time, but we'll live. Oh. I like this boss. Robot bosses are always interesting. They're always really out there. Okay. And get that in. Thank you, yeah, that wasn't crazy crazy. Two and dia, yeah, dia yeah, in and let's see how much damage more energy is here. And there we go. Just a kill. Alright. Next get that fragile. Thank you. Original use. And 18. Alright. We need to go in and oh, that's for the week? Yeah, that's for the week. Let's heal up, and it's four more should be what I need for Shion and Max. Yeah, probably. Cool, cool. And that's... Yep. Four more runs. Pretty much no matter what now. That's locked in. Okay. Unless I got impossibly lucky, which I won't. I won't. Okay. One, two, and you in, and you in. Cool. That's good damage, actually. I like that. And turn that on, and send in Kinich to shoot that as much as possible. Nice, nice, and let's get all those shots in. Okay, cool. Might need a bit of healing, maybe. We'll see what happens. There we are, shooting in. That and jump over. There we go. Thank you. And one, two. Put that down. Money. Right, and mm, the damage there is again. Leaving a bit to be desired, but the missile might do it, depending on how big the crit is, and it simply did not. Okay. Sad. I. That did it. That did it, though. Okay. So. Not that much more is needed, but of course, you toss a few more into her Cinder City set. Really all about maximizing that defense for her. I want a defense, not bad. Her defense and her healing. Alright, and that's your. So she should not have any trouble getting that burst back up. Whenever, really. Okay. Collect that. Cool. So now it's, yep, three more runs and we'll be in the clear. Okay, that said, I might want to actually use some of those artifact juices to get some of those trash artifacts level four so I can get rid of that annoying art notification and make this month's artifact juice. It's possible. Okay. All right. Hmm. Healing is only for party member. Only the current party member. Hmm. Oh, all right then. Try this out and send you in. Thanks. And Milani in again. Thank you. And it's again damage is not all that crazy. How about getting that night soul in and that miss entirely. All right. Cool, shoot, and shoot again. 
Let's see, I want your vulnerability period last. We'll be okay. And up over there. Yeah. Turn that as best we can and jump. Thank you. And send you in. One, two. You know what? Why not? Cool. One, two, and. Yeah, well, that did not actually heal Kunich, though. That's the thing. Nice. And will the missile do it? Missile should hopefully do it. And I. Almost. Almost. Very narrowly not. And that did kill. Okay. And there we are. We just a little bit more. Okay. Two more runs and we're free. Definitely should not have waited. If I wanted to heal, I should have done it beforehand. Given that she does not exactly have a hard time getting her burst back anyway. Which is part of why she's probably... Part of why she's a better option than Baiju on those few many teams. Maybe, depending on how much healing is needed, because she doesn't have team wide healing as a thing. Okay, and two, and switch to Dia, and there we go. Thank you. And keep up with our Night Soul. One, two, three, and. Should be good there, and we switch to you, and. Blast all about my triggers. And. Alright, got in the zone, and there we are, and. I uh, missed that, sadly. Okay, you can go for a fifth if you're very good about it. And there we are. I oh my goodness. That plunge really messed me up. Okay, and we go in and get in and you. Okay. Nice. Ooh, that EM boost is really, really juicing her damage. And that. Wow. Okay. Use use another, though, sadly, that gets me just below another run. And, well, it'd be nice if that was earlier, maybe. Okay, so one more run, and that's as much as Shiona needs, period. Let's get some heal- some... Healing in. Healing in. She even shield in? Okay. So, one more kill on the robot. One more scrapping on the robot, and... Be home free. Do you honestly want to see once I've got her fully boosted how well oh, that team is going to work against Sappho? Actually, as I like running the new Viet team against Sappho, so I just want to see how well that's going to work. And here we are. And I wonder what boost you've got. That's the. Yum buff! Nice! Okay. Nice. Fight. Good damage, even with not being in your vulnerable mode. And I. Okay. Whatever. Come on. And. Let's go for one more just for fun. I. Mm, that did not quite work. Damage from that is not gonna come all that well. That's fun, I suppose. And I. Cool. There you are, shooting in. And. Just nice little transmission up. And. Jump over. Thank you. There we go. That in. Oh, we got that bump again. Nice. And Dia, yeah, Dia, yeah. and Milani. And bite. Good damage. How many crits we get? Another crit, and that will. This will finish it. Missile. Go. And I. That did not work. Huh. Okay. Well, Kunich, you can finish this then. And there we go. Good job. Okay. For those and come back. Fifty-seven left over. I wonder, what I, I wonder what I could use that for. Maybe another run on Cinder City Domain. Okay. So, can level up a little. Just a little. HP, that's fine. She doesn't use attack for anything. Crit rate, good for triggering that fab. And 31 ain't bad. Given that she's going to be dealing a couple of nice hits. Let's check. That's one, two. It's three hits, one for the initial E tap, and then two more. Probably a fourth for the burst, so. The chances of not triggering her Fav proc are very, very low. Okay, well. In that case, I suppose we can run Cinder City Domain one more time, given that. Other people are going to need that set too in the future. 
particular Aura Roan is going to be pretty good Cinder City holder. Okay, and I... Oh, right! I have a lot of resin condensed because did that earlier in the day kind of by mistake. Let's see how many runs I can even do at the domain right now. I can do three runs and then get rid of a bunch of trash. That'll be okay. I can clear out more trash for tomorrow. Alright. Alright. Okay. Running gauntlet and I'm sure everyone who's needed is in here. I probably want to switch out Shionen for Bennett, even though I mean for Emily. Even though she's not contributing to this team at all. Okay, well also I can just Send her for the last time. That's true. That is also true. Okay. Oh, but I do need more for that skill levels too. About helping out. Can't avoid helping. I name these treasures. Some dealing with issues with you. That name and jewels. Okay. Well, do you have enough for 90? Cool. And yeah, we're getting dangerously close to. Uh, we got a good amount still. Yeah, it's consuming a lot of that more though. Yeah, okay. Cool. Alright then. Get over here, we'll try this out. Come on, boosting that damage will not do all that much for me, if anything, really. Come on, I... Well, I mean, it's... The healing ain't bad. And we'll... Thanks, one, two, and... Thanks, one, two, and... Shoot! Over there, I... Oh my goodness. I the wrong one entirely. I hate that. Come on, come on, I... Oh, at least the dragon's helping. And shoot, and... There we go, get a little bit more back. I. It's a shame you got so many problems keeping... Your... First up, even every other rotation. Well, alright, that... Uh, it's just... It's hard to know whether I can afford to throw any of those away. Since it's new and the characters who use them are still coming out. I said a lot of Marsha saying Golden Truth that ultimately I didn't really need, but I couldn't know I didn't need them until time had come, so to speak. And I shoot in the middle of the group. I. Okay, alright, and. Uh huh. Not in there. I don't like this, and. Ah, uh, really? Whatever. Come on, come on. Alright. Apply that. Thank you, and how much more? Another. Thank you, and shoot. There we go. Cool. One more run, but of course we will need to eat some artifacts before I can even do that. Cool. Thank you. And what a fix. That's crit damage. That's alright, I guess. Okay. Mm hmm. I'm taking the three. I wonder why that didn't. Had enough juices for 90. Whatever. Okay. Once we do all the runs we can do here, we'll juice it up the rest of the way and see what I can do. Okay, that. It's got crit damage and. I wonder if anyone, unless you. Except for a stupid DPS shoe on build, would even use. Defense there. Hmm. Either way. She has been made meaningfully stronger. Real great support. Okay. Can't use those juices until I'm certain that I have to. Okay. And let's do this. Come on, come on. Let's see how much each. Rants and thank you. Please don't kill me. Do not kill Bennett. And get I go and and shoot and blast. And we's not in here to trigger the burning off field, so that complicates matters, and there we go, cool. Thank you. You guys saw a guy. Let's see, and use that. 
And... There we are, I suppose. HP... Yeah. Attack? Maybe. Depends on how much ER Ororone ends up needing. Mm. Apparently he will have some self-energy recharge in his kit, but lord knows. So we... Ah, Shilin is in a good spot. Feed that trash to her artifacts. And you know what? Let's get it up all the way. Yep. Cool. And, oh, well, crit damage, not bad. See what it fixes everything else gets from here. And crit rate for the fab proc, good stuff. And... Thank you. Yeah, that does nothing really. Oh, well. Okay, and... Defense, also not bad. Suppose, and... Yeah. More ER. Really can't complain. See, so up 204.7 energy recharge and about 35% crit rate that really should not be any issue with proccing fab now. Okay. She'll have even more once that fab sword gets at 90. It's already honestly more than could ever theoretically be needed and enhance that a bunch of times, so more juices. Nice. Oh, but 60, right, because I did a bunch of that last patch. That's true. Huh, makes me wonder if I should have waited somehow. Huh. I will be enhancing more things, presumably. Presumably. Hmm. Total of 60. Total of 60. Then total 100, which is a whole set. I'll figure out something else to boost up then. You need 10 more of those whistles. So I forgot the ones for Final Ascension. Go back to Fontaine. Those whistles level up some more trash for that artifact juice. So in the end, to get that Battle Pass mission, I could always level up trash. That said, it's there are more characters coming out. Next patch, other patches. It shouldn't be all that much trouble one way or the other. I want to see how many more I'll need. There's some other things, and I need 21 more. It got a lot of whistles, but when you use them, you use them up fast. Okay. So at 1,000, the basic ones, which is still only about 101, 100, 111 of these, but still. Okay, and how many more? Art of craps do I need? That's... I need... Ooh, about six more trash artifacts leveled. Let's see what I'm going to part with, what I've locked. Just see. Crap that is crap, but also locked. Check, it's gladiator pieces usually. Just see. Frankly, there are probably better ways to check. It's ones that just come from bosses. And, well, there's one. Let's just enhance that too. Four. That's cheap. Okay. So the fastest way would probably be to check for the character's interface. We're already getting the talents up to nine all the way, so that'll be fine. So that's how you can just immediately click out. Okay. I, all right. On the wrong thing. Let's see. Switch that out to. We'll filter this to gladiator pieces. Again, they're always ones we can trash. No retracing void pieces at all. Because they're all crap. Okay, five more needed for. Oh, nice! Okay, that's six. I actually mean only four more? Maybe. Let's see. Again, none of these are going to be any good. I guess that's passable. And the nice thing about getting a double healed is more to trash. Okay. Let's put down the printer then. That might be enough, maybe. Yep, that's a couple more Prima Gems and more Battle Pass experience, and that is nicely that a quaint. I'm tossing five blue rolls. No, four, four blue rolls. 
Let me do a bit more extracting. Okay, that. Yeah, all these gotta go. Right, that's good. Yep, that's just enough. Cool. Extract that, and that's our elixir for the patch. We got four of them, which is enough to define a goblet if we need one. Eventually. Will not preclude the need for farming, but it's interesting. It's an idea. Let me just check. Blue Fane, I. Let me just check. Because I. Just check the battle pass rewards. Battle pass. New ones. New missions that are here. Missions, missions, wards, let me check that, and not talking about those missions, actually, let me see, I'm checking the wiki, LFS period, and where did I see a blue fate? Maybe I'm going crazy, whatever. Okay, there was a blue fate somewhere. I... I'm probably going crazy. But either way, we can put in four of these. Okay. Just check, because I think the second one wasn't elixirs. It was a buffet this time for some reason. The wiki does not know that. So put in four, and that'll be take us to 57 on the normal banner. So, all right. Don't really notate this one. See if we get anything. Probably not. Okay. And yeah, 54. 55. And 56. And 57. Okay. Yeah, nothing that time. All right. Cool. So now there are a couple of local legends. Will also, of course. The comms, the comms for the day. Better not forget that. Okay, and we do have, we're gonna have a good amount saved up for Chaska next patch. So the question is just, Mavuika and Satoli will probably be the patch after that, and I'm wondering how that'll go. Hmm, Let's see what happens. All right. Hello, hello. Which everyone in here for Elemental app and movement. Okay. One, two, and blast. One, two, and shoot. I, well, that hit nobody. That totally whipped. One, two, and shoot. I, oh, well, yeah, that completely whipped. Oops. Come on, get over here. I know you want to. You delay yourselves a little and... Oops, okay. Thank you. If you could group yourself, that would be fantastic. And we'll aim for the... Middle of the group, and oh, we got every single one in. Nice. Okay, and we'll shoot, and that did also get both. Nice. Okay, I think Moani in here will do the job a little better, and that did not crit, unfortunately, and there we are. Cool. Okay. Now we got the towers. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. Much to think about. All right, send in our boy, thank you, and we'll shoot that, mm, did not quite work, we'll shoot up there, just get rid of you, and on, and nice stuff, cool. So now, more will show up after I break one of the towers, that's all right. Mm, you've got more attack than any of the others, yep. Just wasn't critting because right, you know, that's points were being consumed at the time. Come on, we will try this out and see how well we can. That did that kill? I think that killed him too. Somehow the blast damage hit, it's a little unreliable, but it worked this time. Not need to fight the guys down here there who eventually come up. This is where I accidentally did that one challenge. And the actual condition is down here. Cool. Thank you. 
All right. Thank you. Try this out and let's keep on going. Make sure we're getting that Phlegiston in and jump. Be a bit hard to reach. The damage from that. I think in this patch they actually gave Milani a bit less vulnerable to fall damage as before it was pretty annoying a lot of the time. And yep, yeah, just gotta time that right. We can glide over. The night soul, and there we are. Cool. Just got one more measly calm to do. That's trimming the horns. The last one I did for the Tetrosaurus was that one. So I'm actually a little surprised that it does not need not having the food one. Because I think once I've done two out of three of the food options, and where are you? I. Wait, okay. Being used by aphid treasure. What's focused experience mode? Or daily, so I don't have to trigger that event, especially since that event wants you to do a lot of Orcon quest stuff. Okay, cool. Go running off this time, yada yada. Such a good boy this stage. Rifty Bowie Health makes this before, treatment the claws. Okay, show them. Yep. I wonder what would happen if we got it wrong. Okay. From the claws, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Like this, quite a lot of detail. Okay, cool. Oh, where are this well behaved? It's like a tough job. Big brush, finer brush. Okay, specific routine. Okay, cool. Follow the instructions. Do that one more time. Big brush, back horn, and then towel. Okay. Cool. Raw, roo, roo, back. And towel. And then the horn, and. Oh, we messed this up. Let the tummy. Oh, no. Oops, he won't let us do it. We messed it up this time. Stares back in confusion, takes over for things deteriorating further. After another single careful grueling, has his claws. It's kind of misread horse sometimes too. The important thing is, I'm sure he knows that you're a good friend of his. Ah, huh, see, so what did I tell you? Thanks so much for your help. Please take these for your trouble. Oops, we messed that up. Well, the historian's really a hard nut to crack. Took me a long time getting no horror before I could figure out most of what he was thinking. It's glad I managed to get that far. After all, the two of us will have to put it up with one another for a while yet. Where's horror? Don't tell me he's run up again. Horror, horror. Well, okay. Oops. And, well. Whatever that new option is, well, there's an achievement. I'll have to wait a little while longer. Oh, Shunin's over there. Probably for the event. Okay. Let's find a place to collect those. Do it in Fontaine. Oops. I wonder if I just misclicked. Because I don't imagine I would have gotten the order wrong. Ah, I don't know. Whatever. Not a big deal. Okay, cool. Let's go and check out. Oh, hello! Thank you for the follow. I actually did not hear that. I apologize. How are you doing? Death is Artly. I'm just doing. <laughs> I rolled for Sheila Nen earlier. We got her at around 78 or so. Won that 50 50, and then I busted my back to kill that boss enough times to get her to 90. She's doing great, actually. <laughs> I was just about to do something pretty cool, which is, are you familiar with the new local legend that Kaholosaurus warrior, wave shuttler, Sappho amidst the wave, named after the most famous lesbian in history, but erroneously referred to as a man in the achievement? Well, either way, Shunen is an upgrade in my favorite Nubi Fury team to Baiju. So we are going to see just how good this team is by sending them up against each other and... That Hydro might not be that good, because it means she'll be able to freeze me really easily, so I will make it tomorrow and hope that she, hope that it stops raining, so that this fight will go a bit better. But yeah, this Nuviat, Fiorina, Shionen, and Kaza is now currently a really great team. Oh, that's right, we got a new avatar because we got Shionen. Oh, right, and redesign. So what are you changing about her specifically? Is she more armored? That's something I see a lot. And I like that dis I like that decision. Okay, so let's get this started. And try this out. Okay, the healing. 
She wanted not having too much healing does her ends. Ah, oh, but there we go. There we go. Okay, and we'll grab this out. Get its healing in. So just sort of a standard samurai armor, I presume. Okay, and we'll sort Kaza again. And that's right. We need to. Did I even put that through? Whatever. And come on, I to see and get that back. Other way. This does seem to be pretty good, but the fact that the healing is not team wide does kind of hurt this team with multiple rotations. That is true. Let's see how this works, and please do not try to freeze me, I beg of you. Kaze taking that hit is not fun. Okay, and we'll. Two, three, let's trigger that stab, hopefully, and we'll. Oh, goodness, I keep blasting. Not bad at all. Mm -hmm. Does have some issues, but Kaza will get some of that healing. Her healing is good. Okay, and we'll try that out. Uh, oh, goodness. Stay away from that. And one more, and there we are. Now this... She's a really hard boss. But what I really love about the new local legends is just... That they make fighting them a viable way to farm certain... Oh, uh, certain certain materials, because for example, my farming route for Whistles is literally just, I fight her. That is my entire farming route. Which is a lot more fun than just going around the game world, in my opinion. But I guess it's a little subjective. Okay, along this last, and fall damage she's taking is doing a lot of work. The other way, it... I'm actually not sure how I feel about that, just because since there isn't team wide healing, Seems that there are some issues getting that back up. So honestly, I think I'll probably stick to Baju on that team. But Shiwanen is really, really, really good for Milani, among other things. Big thing about Milani is... If you try to run Kaza, it will usually... It's hard for Kaza to swirl and buff with Viridescent Venerer without getting rid of the power she wants to vaporize. Either way, there are a couple of Kinich challenges that I didn't do next patch because I wanted to save exploration for this patch to try to do stream event stuff. And then they said, oh, no stream event this patch. We gave up on marketing in the West. And I was just, okay, well, you know, I still want to play the game. I'm still going to be playing, so I may as well stream it, you know? That's how I feel about these things. So I'm going to put Kinich back in real quick. Okay. Just so I can do this challenge, because I did this before and got a few chests from this, but... Oh, additionally, I do have... Yeah, I'm really close to overcapping, that is also true. We'll just see how many crap artifacts this gives me, and where I can trash this, and... Oh, and of course it went off the edge. What an inconvenient location. I am not letting that dull blade go. It might be useless, I'm still not letting it go. Nice thing is we can just climb up. I... You can put that in... I think self-promo would be the best option. Anytime you want to do any kind of personal art stuff, I'd say that's the best place to put it. Okay, so here we are. We already got all the rewards. We got max rank, but we didn't get every single coin. And I... I refuse to stop before I get max score. I just did this to test out Kinich. This wasn't real exploration, quote unquote, for us to sound as a canopy, agility, and finesse for essential qualities. That's why I prepared this Warriors Challenge. Thanks for joining the Discord. Welcome back, Kel. Guess who got Shionen winning that 50-50 at around 78 or so. Which means continuing to be able to roll for new characters and show off how I build them to everyone here. Not to brag, I'm, I'm just being informative. I don't like to boast, I'm just being informative. So Outlander Warrior. Yeah, I'll, I'll check that out real quick, actually. I want to take a swing at this. Good pun. Let's begin. Let's check. And I... Yeah, welcome, by the way. To see. Oh! Oh, and face tats? And a bit of... Oh, does she have the sort of euthymia hands on her face? That's cool. Okay. That's cute. Okay. And just see. As many challenge coins as possible, so we'll grapple right into there. It's more fun to do it with the actual character than it is with the dinosaurs, frankly. Because I see a lot of the... The ride-in from... You know, the boss ride in there, and I- Oh my goodness, I messed that up. I messed that up. Oh my goodness. Shouldn't have- I, mean, I, can, I think I can see the- I have the combo gauge sticking down. Oh, so it's very puppet. I really do wonder... 
This auto plays Star Rail, but I like that they have a lot of alt characters, and I hope we get alts in Genshin eventually. The big one would honestly just be Delusion Tartaglia, because, you know, two or so years after they teased it originally in the boss fight, they made him relevant again in Fontaine, and even though it's just in the cutscene, they still show him fighting in Delusion form, and it's just, it's such a missed opportunity to me. But, the thing about Genshin characters is just, given that they have to care about frame dead and hitboxes instead of just stuff like turn order... Oh, okay. Oh, so it's sort of, okay, so it's sort of a battle damage Shogun as her own character. That's a cool idea. Yeah, you know, if only... Yeah, Hoyo should have been greedier. If Hoyo were greedier, they could have made the, they could have made the Shogun as her own character. But unfortunately for us, I suppose, they showed re uncharacteristic restraint. Okay. Keep on going, just jump over. I guess I could do a bit of grappling, maybe. That's an idea, just to move around a little bit faster. It's a good thing that the cooldown doesn't matter here. Let's just see. I hope I didn't miss anything this time. Right, right. And I where were the five challenge coins I missed? I... Okay, this is freaky. There are five challenge coins somewhere here that I just am missing, and I don't know why that is. Oh my goodness. But, I will say, and it's always unfortunate, but it's just, when people ask, including myself, why a character looks kind of weird and screwy, the answer is usually just, they had to make sure it works with hitboxes, with collisions, in the game world. Okay, let me just see how many targets there are. I, This is funky. Oh, nice! Oh, ca Canada! How's Canada? I know some people from Canada. I... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I keep grappling incorrectly. This is actually vile. So what am I missing and where? What am I missing and where? Okay, and I... Okay. I thought I saw something down there, maybe? I really, really wonder. What am I missing? What am I missing? My goodness. So I go over here and... That's fair. I mean, to be fair, from what I hear, from what I know, frankly, the only inhabited parts of Canada are the ones that actually aren't as cold. That said, I... Personally, I like cold. I'm generally not very good with heat, personally. So I... Just, where is that? Where are those final five coins? Okay, we got all we got all of them this time. I don't know what I was missing. Well, max out our coins and that's all that matters. Okay. Yeah, I... I despise summer. You know, free time is nice, so that's increasingly untrue as a functional adult with employment. What's it time for? Just check over here. So what are helix piercings? I'm actually unfamiliar. Yeah, I, I desire an explanation to understand the kind of pain you've put yourself through. Additionally, there is a there's a switch over here that is something and that make that spinner. Oh, you have to time that. Oh, okay. And I, oh, no, you need to complete that by making it, or, wait, complete it by, there we go, and oh, it sends up a wind current to that oculus as well, as well, because it's a, oh, and that's even a broken graffiti stone, interesting, let's get this, upper part, outer edge, that, oh, and we even got, we got to 60 now, said, I think there's another, it's also that Monitu cave. Just look that up real quick. Helix piercing. That. Oh, okay. Oh, now, now I kind of understand. Okay. So it's pretty much. Oh, it's about the place where it is. Okay. As in the helix of the. Okay. Oh wow. I guess I assume you always get this question that you're probably sick of it by now. So, you know, can tell me how sick of it you are. But how much does that hurt? Because I. Personally, pain is not the issue for me, but I always wonder just how it feels. I mean, I, I presume you get used to it, or 
It's just, you know, like getting a shot or something, but... So I, there is supposed to be another Master Trainer around here somewhere. I'm just seeing enemies. Either way, it doesn't really matter because I got... I got to 60 in here. Also, there's that Monitu Cave. Let's see how many graffiti stones I can put down, actually. I've got three now. That's... It's a funky, funky cave here. And this is... It's actually completely unmarked as well. Huh. Yeah, sure. I can check that real quick. For comparison, I've just got Earthshaker and Obsidian. Not 99, of course. And I got 46.6 crit rate, which is 86.6. I got uncharacter. Oh! Four out of. Hajime Mashenshi, I am not sure what just happened there. But I am back. Not sure what happens. Back now. Okay. We will. Play this one by ear. I apologize sincerely for how ridiculous this has been. Okay. Okay. Well, we were just at this graffiti rock when I fi tried to figure out what was happening. And we're equipped in an amusing position. Okay. Second, let me pull up my monitor. Kinich is having some fun. Okay. Meantime, I guess I'll just put in the graffiti rocks. Broken graffiti marks zone one, complete the wall graffiti, and it's a bit bigger. Wonder how many we'll need. And that gets a bit bigger. Another stone. And oh goodness. We'll need a few more. I like that. I like that. Long term. Okay, either way, we can go and max out Kinich's tribe's wrap. Okay. Let's see if this changes how this appears at all. And yeah, that'll get me to maximum. Awesome. And that's one blazing foot ore, which I believe also we got. Running outcrop search and divine army bathed by hidden sun, Shabalanke's forces advance with unstoppable momentum. Brings all at war to the world once more, but his goals don't stop there. Okay. One is right back. Now on mining outcrop search, I don't go mining anymore at all. Okay. Let's see if that looks any different, and it doesn't look any different. Flint ore gets its name from the radiant glowed harbors. When grass in one's hand, one can feel the fiery pulse thrum within the stone. Perhaps one day, held high against the starry sky, it might emit a gentle gleam that illuminates the night. Says you, can't you that? Wait for the moment to activate this item. Oh, that's crazy. It's definitely going to be Pyro Traveler. Con materials. Either way, we can't do anything here anymore. Which means we can do a little bit more for people of the springs. Just got to get some bounties in. Yeah, I'm just going to mention... Oh! That is cool. I... It would be funny, because people have been talking about Granny Ping as a new character, possibly coming out soon. It'd be really funny if people were joking that she should have a grandma form. That allows her to basically walk around as the NPC and maybe avoid any enemies, which would be really funny, in exchange for, you know, not doing damage. It's under that kind of incognito mode, basically. Okay, either way, we can do one supply notice. One of those, let's check the others. I'm gonna be doing those for the other tribe real quick, and then one bounty for you should clear it out. Dandro res decrease, could work with... Also, the fact that they mentioned kicking people out of the Fatui for banditry is very much setting up, you know, Fatui being good guys again. I do like that a bit. I do like that a bit. Also, to be fair, I need to get rid of... Oh, goodness. Get rid of the corrupted video. So accept that for the people. The springs. That will allow us to finish them out. Just go over here. Since they're immune to Dendro, to Anamo, but weak to Dendro, we'll try out that Kinichi team again. Who has? Who's been reduced to a crying mess? Let's check this. Yeah, we should still put an Emily, just to be sure. 
But either way, that's no more bounties to do for a while. It's kind of crazy to think about. And we can grapple up here. That's convenient. Well, it... The one thing I have to say about... I think, to be fair, it could have been done better. But I think it's perfectly good and fine that, you know, her entire backstory is all her friends dying, her sister dying, and her basically just going crazy from loss. And it, to be entirely frank, well, I think there are some issues with the sort of, some of the way she's presented, but I think a character changing and healing from trauma is not necessarily a bad thing. That being stoic all the time is not the only way to be strong. And it's not as if she hasn't had cool moments since, though to be fair, she hasn't really been relevant for a while. The last we saw of her was the Rhythm Game event with Ito and the Dorok NPC guy in the summer, where she and Yai talked about basically allying all the nations, presumably against the Abyss, eventually. But, which is also kind of fed into the Mutual Security Simulation event before, I believe, or maybe that was after. Who knows? Main thing is... The one thing that I don't like about her entire storyline is the fact that Skara erasing himself from Irminsul means that that story isn't really going to get closure that involves her. Which bothers me a little as someone who likes both characters and thinks that it could make for very interesting... I think drama is the wrong word, but very interesting emotional plot lines. And to have her, you know, to have an actual confrontation and maybe, frankly, some admission of wrongdoing or at least an apology. Because... And the other thing is that Raiden does have a voice line for him that also gets deleted after you do his sort of pseudo story quest Archon quest because everyone forgets about him. So it's totally... Oh, and that... I love going for the manual aiming, but it's easier to miss than I like. Okay, so that's one, and that should mean... Yep, People of the Springs is now a maximum. Can go over and collect that reward, I suppose, because that still still needs to be picked up. Okay. Go over, pick that up, and there we are. Get another Blazing Flint Ore, and the ability... Oh, right, we got a Borderline Billet Trail. Well, that'll be okay eventually. So we can also, we can go over to Children of the Echoes now. I don't really use a lot of crafted weapons anymore, frankly. So the only five-star personal weapon I have is actually... That would be... Oh, right, and there's Shulanan. You look confident in yourself. Okay, so that's... This one is good for the... Chevy Overload team I run for Arlequino. Since Arlequino is a bad app, you don't really want her with... Oh... Reaction-based teams. Electro Res. I try Sethos on that one. That said, I won't really be doing that bounty anymore. Okay... And Spray Feather Kill, so just doing those two bounties will clear things out, which is crazy to think. And until, well, actually, once we get more tribes, which is going to be next patch, we'll get Nightwind and Flower Feather. Since there's no stream event, and this is not drops enabled, the Mahoyo Ninjas are not watching me, for better or worse, and I can talk about leaks as much as I want, for better or worse. Okay, so let's get... I want to see how much Chevy can shoot, actually. I want to see if... Because I got her C4 today just randomly off banner. That team is Arla. Yai, official. Yai needs a new golden troop set, too. And... So how much have you heard about... The Archon Quest this patch. Because I haven't done it yet, but I've seen some information on it. And you do have... Yep, you've got R5 Fab Lance. That's good. Everyone's got the right weapons, just in case. I'm excited to experience it for myself. I know that some pretty crazy things happen. But it... <sighs> Capitano had better be playable. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Capitano had better be playable. Okay... That's not necessarily a bad thing. We'll, we'll, well, we'll see whether I can finish it this weekend, though. But apparently it shouldn't be all that bad. We'll see. Hold mode will not go on cooldown when she uses it after using Ring of Burst and Grenade, so I'm not sure whether that 
replenishes a usage if you've already used it before the burst. Let me just see. Over here. Still. No, because I got Keen H relatively early, actually. And I didn't roll on the Yoimi and Chevy banners. So I had C0 Chevy before, just totally randomly. When I was rolling for Arla, actually. When I was rolling for Oakino's weapon, I got my first Chevros randomly on the weapon banner. Completely randomly, which is why it was such a good day of rolling. But these, I got another random one today, but these three all came from the Kinich banner, actually, I believe. But I didn't roll a lot on Kinich because I got him early. Which, I guess that's the downside. As dumb as that sounds. We got that blazing flint ore right there. If that's new, build it filled with potential. All of them are filled with potential. I really do wonder what Pyro Traveler is going to be like. They have totally hyped up, hyped them up so much, so... You know, they definitely better be good, but what that good entails is another flesh and eye. Let's just see if I can shoot that and... Okay, that does not replenish it. So you can get two shots in after. Interesting, okay. You have to use it first, and then you can get your two shots in. Okay, alright. Ah, this is a little annoying. And we'll see if we can destroy right there. And that was passable, I suppose. Good old fragile Arlequino. So I'm gonna go in and use the very silly Southos team I have, especially since Kirara has no cons and is not even leveled, meaning that because I got my first Kirara from the summer event as well. So when I fight that Yumkasaurus warrior, I run a very silly team, but that's Fischl, Sucrose, Kirara, especially since Kirara is honestly not good for any application until she's C4. And again, C0. And Sethos is holding on to the slingshot that he borrowed from, that Yoimiya originally had, but now Yoimiya has R4 Rust for me. Let's just tap that down, get a little bit back. That should be fine, because it'll trigger a quicken. That will mean totally maxed out bounties, and then I have two more Nightsoul Totems. So what does everyone think about the Notlon Local Legends? Because I love them, but I'm also incredibly sweaty. I roll for pretty much everyone and try to build as many characters as possible on pure horizontal investment. That's also I like theater too, as in Imaginarium theater. So this will finish it up. We'll get everyone. And there we go. Let's swap that. And I, oh goodness, I, let's toss this down at you. I, oh my goodness, are you even going to get this in? I really do wonder. Okay, I, mm, that's going to be kills on them. I don't like that. I, oh, please don't. Oh, no. That went about as badly as it could have. Oops. Okay, well, we tried. I just needed to aim for the big warrior because, you know, as you see, you take damage outside that dual zone and I. That was not good for me at all. Look, wait, it's not all that crazy to get Southos back. It, it's got to get a bit more of that in. Let's just see how many particles we can feed you, ideally. And, thank you. Good reaction. Okay, that should be good now. I... Complicated feelings about this. Very complicated feelings. Let's try this again. See what happens this time. Oh, baby. Luckily, as scuffed as this team is, it's not the one I'm going to use for the two remaining local legends, which are Shimali over here and, no, not Shimali, but Sukawada with Chimeric Bone and Hikuhopuili's Aegis over here. Puzzle's right there. My goodness. Yep. Perilous. Always go for the Perilous. Thank you, and... Swirl that, and... Thank you, I... We'll manage that as best as we can, and put this down, and... Yep, put that in, and we have to get back in the area, and pierce this through, which is really nice, but we just need to make sure we get the right guy. Okay, and put you down, and scroll that, and kill it out again, and Sothos will make this work in just one more shot, and I love the fact that you can fire off those crazy charge shots. What sucks is just, 
it's not that good. And if you play him optimally, you just use his normal burst shots. Oh, nice. Let me check. I want to see if that turns gold. It doesn't appear like look any different when he max out. Let's see. Oh, okay. Oh, so you're going into... Uh, is that... What website is that? Or is that... What app is that? That's... So you're adding gray hairs. Changing the eyes. There are a number of things I can do. Visual art is notably not one of those. Okay. Oh, ibis paint. Okay. So now we have the ability to make the treasure compass. Okay, a genius indication TCG back for not one. And there we go, we got all the currently accessible tribes at level 4. That's nice. Now that does not look any different. You know what, let's make a treasure compass. Apparently next patch is actually going to boost how treasure compass works too, actually. That it'll be able to show challenges and COEs. It won't show hidden chests though. But it's still a step there, I suppose. We'll see what happens. Okay, let me see... Let's make that... Oh, right, no, we gotta go... We gotta go to the forge. I may be stupid. Okay. Right, let's put in a team that actually kind of works for us. So we're gonna be doing not one stuff. All right, all right, all right. Workshop is... Right, it's down that way. Let's go ahead and... Do a roar skating dash, and this is good no matter where you are, more or less. Make me a compass, I demand it. Okay, this is a jaguar. Let's take that description. A compass that can be used in not want to search for nearby chests amidst the turmoil and strife that rack the land. Many treasures throughout the vast nation of Pyro have gotten accounted for. All traits of their whereabouts lost, and that's a bunch of the flowers we got for Keenage, so that's not a problem. And no bonus for that. How sad. And that's 30 seconds of waiting. I presume because they think people might actually want to, want to cancel it. It is interesting that I've never done it, but it is technically possible to make duplicates of these. But there's no reason. You get nothing out of it. It doesn't let you bypass cooldown. It's just... And then you have a two there. Oh, right. I need I need to check. Sorry, I forgot because we because that broke down. Let me check your Kinich. And you said you did get his weapon, right? Let me just check. Let me see what he looks like with a weapon. Let's check that real quick. Because you're on. Oh, and he's your new... I like that. Literally you. Yep, it thing. Okay, let me see. And of course, you know, you could get that to 90, but I, you know that already. Okay, 76 and... It's a good crit and... That's not bad, yeah. I like that. It's... Generally speaking, 5100 is basically the baseline for acceptable crit. And that, with Obsidian, that's 76.8 and 137.4, so... Okay, let me check that goblet. Oh, wow! Wow. Yeah, so you could easily... If you got other pieces... No, those are all good. The main thing is... Oh, attack circlet instead of crit circlet. If you gave him a crit damage circlet... I didn't even notice that. You had a good rate even with that. You would be crazy crazy. With a... Actual crit damage circle. That could be something worth using the artifact juices for. But that's real good. Yeah, I was just... Okay, that's good for something... You know, normal crit setup. But no, that's non-standard. You don't even have a crit circle in. It's already good. You know, with a crit damage circle, you'd be able to get him around almost 200 crit damage. Which is insane to think about. Oh my goodness. <sighs> wow. So in that case, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna find the local legend over here. See how that works. It does make me a little sad that... I'm probably gonna use the Arla team against the... One of the local legends is a grapple, but... Like I was asking before, what does everyone think about the new... Not one local legends? Like, especially at maximum... World level. Because I've been on... World level 9 ever since it became an option, and oh my goodness, is it... It's fun, but it really does kick me in the face sometimes. Zhongli, Zhongling, and Bennett. Okay. You said he didn't have Emily, right? It'll be interesting to see how his teams change as time goes on, but... I think... I run with Emily, Dia, Bennett. Because 
And he also helps a bit with durability, which is a weakness of him. One of his weaknesses. Let's take you out by shooting these at you. Oh, and of course we can just use that for burning. That's right. And get that power up, and there we are. Gotta love hunting saurians. Okay. Should be a hook somewhere to open those up. These are the Jion and flowers. Already have more than enough, but... Hook is... Oh, the hook's... No, that's not the hook. Let's just see. We break that. Yep, go over. We can unearth that. That's passable, I suppose. Hmm. Trying to figure out where I can get the hook to actually pull that. Okay. Okay, okay. For future reference... Oh, okay, now I remember. I actually remember seeing that. For future reference... Unless you get really annoyed of wait, unless you get really annoyed waiting for me to solve a puzzle, and you're just okay, I can't stand it anymore. Generally, I prefer solving on my own. It's no harm, no foul, and I don't blame you. But just for future reference, it's really no issue at all. Though. It, like I said, it's no issue at all. You don't have to apologize. I didn't make it all that clear, so. But it's right here. Okay, and up on top, I believe, is also that. Iraculus. Let's grab that. Right. Oh, that takes you down to the same place anyway. Oh, okay, so we can pull that, and I wonder where that leads to then. This is... What is... Pull that... Oh, it pulls it out of the ground. Well, that's fun. But I wonder if I could have broken that as well. We'll remove that grappling hook. I have to get on the other side. To, what is this in the ground? I... Ah, okay, cool. And... What can I do? If we smack this, I... No, oh, that doesn't do it. So I wonder how I'm supposed to pull that out. We'll see what happens. Let's see what happens when I reinsert this and pull it with Kinich. Okay, pull that and... Now you're coming out. Oh, is that going to be the totem? Let's see what happens. Oh, it's going to destroy that rock and reveal the totem. Oh, okay. This... Oh, no, there are three of these, so I need to... Do something in three different places to make that work clearly. There's also this right here. Is this search and just beetles? Let's take you out then. Come on, come on. Let's see. And that's a shot. And we got you in here. I got that going. Shoot. And one more. Should hopefully do it. I. Uh, I. Ah, uh, we just barely missed that. Come on, physical hits, physical hits. Get smacked with my actual sword that I never actually use. Okay, so this, hopefully, let's see, and, well, that keeps searching. Oh, so that keeps moving. It's another one of those underground things. Yep, and it comes up here, so we need one more from somewhere. May as well open the chest while we're in the area. This is real cool. Okay, ignite a treasure hunter. Finally came, Tecmacon Stronghold, so offense. Well, I, I think it was with Abyss buffs, but I think it was around, probably around 130 or something. That's what I'd say. I I could do a bit of quick math, actually. Quick math, actually. That should be with that buff. Maybe getting around three thousand base attack. Let's check three thousand base attack. So it crit would be three thousand times. Let's see. Thousand times thirty. 3, 3, and let me just check his bonuses. That'd be additional 64, 3, 3, about 66, and then 80. Yeah, probably something around 140, 150. It's, it's because you have an attack circuit and a 5-star weapon. Mine has a crit damage circuit. Because it's all about maxing out his crit. Generally speaking, I'm sure you've heard this before, the standard setup is generally attack... Well, I mean, attack sands, some kind of crit rate or crit damage circle, depending, and then a damage bonus goblet. Because those all multiply with each other. Generally speaking, boosting attack further, especially when there are a lot of attack buff sources like Pyro Resonance and Bennett, which Kinich already uses. An attack... If you don't have any better options, because for an atta for Sans, attack is your best option in most cases. And West, for example, it's Reaction Dendro. And the weapon is good, but it's mostly... It would mostly be that attack circuit, frankly. 
Especially since you've already got a high multiplier. High attack, base attack weapon too. Yeah, yeah. It's a really good weapon. It is basically just for Keenich, but it's really good for Keenich as a result. It's on the final. This have to be somewhere over here, I presume. I wonder what direction that is. I... Something must be in the ground. And, oh, well, there's a... One of you guys. Kave? Well, it... Running DPS Kave is... Unfortunately, a sad joke. And will that bring something out of the ground? It did not actually appear like it. Huh. Okay, well, alright. Let's send Milani in to the final bite. Okay, nice. And I... Final, final. Oh, you're all in that general direction. So this one points more or less over this way. Probably up on the ridge. I mean, in the end, and I hate to say it... Someone who has a decent concave, albeit not one who's built. There aren't a lot of things he's really good for. Makes me sad. So I wonder where the final might be over here. Just gotta figure out how to get it over. Maybe this way? Maybe this way. Hmm. Either way, this is the one that has another Y of Manifestation. And I... Oh, it's probably just this. I bet. I imagine. Hitbox is actually missing that a little. It's weird. Come on. Let me just see. Can she... Okay, you can pull it up, but you can also grab it. Grab that hook. So there are multiple ways to unearth that. Okay, nice. This should be our Knight's Old Totem. That's a cool way to find it, actually. I like that. And there we are. We got it. Oh, luxurious chest, too. Nice. And no space left. All right, well, okay. What can I? Oh, we even got another... Oh, a green obsidian fragment from that. Huh. Well, that's interesting. And does that mean... Let me just check. Should also mean we now also have enough to craft the ring. An obsidian fragment with engraved patterns, style like those of the Sons of the Academy, which you obtain by chance while exploring. It appears that you could form a full ring using three of them, though what that will achieve you cannot tell. The green obsidian ring is an established medium by which the tribe established contact with the Deep Knight. Perhaps its strength will ride across the boundary between this place and a certain other location. Well, because it's random. It's actually randomized which chests give those. You just have to get lucky. You just need to find pretty much everything. <laughs> Luckily, the treasure compasses are better next version. Or you can use the interactive map. I mean, of course, you, I imagine you don't want to have to wait, but... Let me just see. I, you know what? I want Hazel to be good eventually. I like him. We did a feed trash to somebody. In the meantime, especially since we made this much artifact juices. It's just any high tier chest has a chance of dropping the ring. It is, and I cannot stress this more, random. Okay, so it's time to fight that local legend. I love these local legends so much. This, yep, land a decision. Twelve decisions, ring this trial, the four years, swift, wild well, manifestation, will exile the character to a land of decision, or we must touch a knight's soul fault to leave the land and return to the battle against the manifestation. The land of decision is activated, the four years, manifestation, something that's a warrior is on the field to do battle. Defeating them will bestow the curse effect, you stash curse, increase the damage dealt by all party members, also cause you to continuously lose HP, curse the deck up to 15 times. <laughs> up to 15 <laughs> times, okay. Well, it sounds like newbie fury team time. Unfortunately, that does mean... Shilinan was actually not as great for this team as I expected. Well, whatever. We're okay. She's good for other things. We're over here. Well, I will scales resilient. All right. And when are you going to exile me? I let's get out of the way of that. And come on, keep blasting. And it's already good. It's already good. Okay, cool. Let's see when you exile me, and I mm, dodge out of the way of that. Make sure I don't get hit by attacks. A lot of dodging to make that work, and... Okay, when are you going to exile me to the land of decisions? Let's see how much curse we want to get, and I... Funny B moment, we got 4 out of 6 for this version there, and oh! Oh, and it's nice and gray, too. Okay. Let's make sure we don't get hit. Also a bit of a poison field effect, too, and I... Come on, come on! Damage, alright, and we got a bit of curse from that. Luckily, we got healing. 
Thank you, and... There we go. Let's make sure we don't get hit. I. Let's see who we need to take out. And I... Okay. Get that going, and... Put that down. And, okay, let's get as much curse as we can. I... Want to see... And I... Oh, my goodness. All right. I, got 15. Let's get out of here. And Oh, no, I died. I died. Oops. Let's go home. Let's go home. It's all full, and... Biden eyes. It looks like someone is going to need a bit of restoration. Somebody, somebody just died. Okay. Let's do a bit of revival. I was not expecting it to be that, that spicy. Eat your vegetarian abalone. And we're no longer taking the damage, which is good. I hit with that. Oh, yeah. I just want to see what would happen when I max it out. Believe me, I knew it would get real bad. That was the whole point. And I, oh, no, we, we got exiled already? Wait. Oh, no. The timing on that is actually vile. Oh, goodness. Huh, okay. Huh. That's different. Okay. Huh. Okay, okay. Put that in. Much damage I can deal because I do not want to keep getting exiled. That's crazy. Huh, you are actually evil. Okay. Huh. And getting that rotation up is... Confusing. Okay. Huh. Yeah, when are you gonna exile me that land of decision? Uh, even without curse, we're okay here. But it's a matter of finding the right time here. And I oh, okay. So that gets rid of that as well. Okay. Well. Yeah, we can keep trying this, but I. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try to knock it down then. Especially since. One of them has to do with avoiding damage, and that's going to take some craziness. Okay. Yeah, I can understand why you'd want to do such a thing, because I want to do that, too. Yeah, yeah. It's certainly something. And that sword did not quite work. Well, keep moving out of the way and just brute force this. All right. Awesome. 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 I feel like more might be nice. We'll see. It's just a matter of... Oh, well, I... Okay. Annoying. Let's see how many we can take out in the meantime. I... Luckily, there are a lot of dudes in here to take out, but I... I... Gotta... Swirl, swirl, and... Just keep away from a lot of annoying things. Okay, we can go through the default end. Okay. Thank you, and... Well, that, except none of you. Okay, cool, and out of the way. I, ah, come on, I did not mean to do that. I, come on, you. Okay, I dodge. Be hard to, oh my goodness. Can't believe that stopped me. I, this is genuinely one of the toughest bosses I've had to fight, period. It, engaging with a gimmick is tougher than I would like. Hmm. Yeah, I... I don't dislike this, but it's a very unique kind of challenge. Especially since you have to gamble and see how much you're willing to go in for. It really is like that. Okay, so we'll do a full rotation here and do a full rotation outside, I think. That should get me somewhere good. I Thank you, and bars you, and sure. Get close to the fault, actually, and that should keep things okay. Get that healing up, and oh, we're at 15. Nice. I, I, oh my goodness, again. You've got to be kidding. Come on. Well, all right. I. The timing on that is. At least we've got our damage bonus, so Firina should be able to do well here. But I really, really wonder what the best way to do this is. So I am going crazy. Egg roll, we can use that at least. And cool, move yet. And can I? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I, well, whatever. Come on, come on. I, that did not even scroll correctly, whatever. Oh, okay, well, got high curse. Which is a, uh, oh, well, whatever. Hate you too. Hate you too. Okay, once we get to 10, that's as much as I can really afford to get to without just dying outright. Oh, well, we got through. For a sufficient amount of curses, Lord knows how much that's going to be for me. 
Okay, and we'll go through. Okay, thank you, and we'll try this out. Thanks, Purina. Okay, this should not be a huge problem then. But dodging all the attacks is going to hurt me. And, well, we did it. We did one. So that's a little bit wit up. Yeah, okay. It's not lit up, but it's highlighted. That legitimately is a crazy fight. I need to go get some energy back and heal up, and I need to see what the next achievement is. That might be the new damage one. Defeat local legend, Ika Huipoi's Idris. Defeat 10 Knights of Wars during the Trial of Decisions, and then there's the one of taking no damage, which... Honestly... Sure. If you'll give me a second. Question is what kind of team you want to run. Because I actually... <sighs> Newbie Fury team is really good for the Fitui Trio. That's how I got... I got all their achievements... The best would probably actually be an Ayaka team, honestly, but I don't have Ayaka. I got all their achievements, and I did it using a Nubi Fury team. That's how I managed to make that work. So, you want to figure that out. I do actually want to fight them again. I, mm, I need a bit more energy for Fiorina. I guess the question is just, what kind of team would we be able to put together? The main thing is having a way to break all their shields. And the way I did it with the new V Fury team, because it's also a matter of being able to actually deal enough damage, so the fight doesn't last a full hour, because it can go on forever. But, the thing with the new V Fury team is, yeah, it's Kaza, Baju, new So, what you basically do is you swirl... You swirl Cryo onto the Electro guy to break his shield, you swirl Pyro onto the Cryo guy, break his shield, and then you use the Hydra on your team to just break the Pyro shield. That's generally, it's, you basically just need Hydro and a swirl, Swirler in the team to make it work. It's actually not that complicated, but... Okay, let's get some back for you, and of course, Little Furina having lots of energy recharge. Cool. Almost there. Almost there. Come on, come on. Get some of that back, and... Cool. Yep. Right. But... Newbie Fury Team is what I run in that comp, but 10 Night Soul Warriors in the Land of Decisions. If I can get 10 or so, rotation should be fine. Let's see what happens, but I really need to stay close to that rift. Yeah, I'm going to try this one more time. Shikoadal Chimeric Bone. It's just about grappling and finding a way to burn down stuff. See. About setting her grapple points on fire. Let's try this again. Special amount of curses. Farzan and Wanderer. It. Do you have Kaza? Who do you have animal wise? Because. There's no healing on that team, which would make using Furina tough. Okay. Okay, okay. As in Wander for healing? That's interesting conceptually. Okay, and I- Oh, that's taking damage. Off to- well, Next time we'll be okay. That'll be okay next time. And we'll- Let's try that out, and- Thank you, Kaza, and are you going to send me the line decisions now? I think you are. I don't like that. I, come on. I, oh my goodness. That's a lot of ones in a row. That's ridiculous. I... Gene could work. Gene can work. That's actually very... Very doable. Okay, so let's... See if I can swirl, and we got you, and got that poison in. I... That's... We got Baiju in. That's good. And you got... Oh, you gotta go a bit more. That's annoying. Spin a win. Spin a win. Okay, let's scroll back. Get a bit of healing in and see how many more we need. Spin a win. And there we go. Not so full. Nice. And got a bit more in there. Very good damage. Okay, cool. See how many we can get through. Oh, my goodness. 
Damage is ridiculous. Oh my- What? Already? I hate you so much. Come on, whoa. Try to get those swords going and get that through. Flood is crazy. Definitely needs to be brute force otherwise. And damage is good and avoid a sufficient number of curses. Okay, and whoa. Go up and spin a win. Okay, cool. Not spin a win, but move around a win and I Okay. And you did not die. You did not die. That's good. That's very, very good. Okay, and how many lands a decision are you gonna make me go through? Okay, and we'll do that and come on. Alright. Do not do not send me away as fast as time. I beg of you. Okay, and one, zero, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and okay, jump up and over that to swirl that and well we can try and see how the way of that multiverse. I uh, it's a crazy fight. But we've got a lot of Nutso Warriors down, so this should be good. After this one, I'll help you out. Rest assured, okay. Just gotta get you in a good position. They kinda home into me, so... Shouldn't be a huge problem. I, okay, cool. Use that to survive and... Come on, get as many curses as I physically can. Okay, cool, and we'll get that healing in, and there we go. And we can even get that back. Nice. Okay, cool. So, another. There we go. Thank you. I be a lot of dodging involved. Okay. Thank you. And we got so many of you chum. Good. One final. Fight and blast should do the trick with you. And I. Come on. Shoot and. We killed with a burst. That was fun. Okay. So I'll hop on in to try that fight with you. Okay, so only one achievement left, and that would be the no damage one, which... Is it not getting hit by attacks, or not getting damage from attacks? During the course of completing a single challenge, defeat 10 Nutsal's Warriors during the Travel Decisions, we got like 45. Without being hit by any attacks, so yeah, I think... Oh, goodness. Who that team would... Honestly, I... Hit by any attacks? Probably... Our old team? Our old team could work. But before I'll uh, weave this nightmare realm and help you, I am nothing if not beneficent. Actually, I'm plenty of other things too. Okay. Whether they're good or not remains to be seen. Honestly, I think. You might not need a Fiorina. If you have someone who can buff New Viet at all. Maybe I can have my Kaza and Baiju do the hard work of breaking a bunch of the shields. Because that's a delicate process. It's a very delicate process. So if you'd like, I can handle that. I have no qualms handling that. Because... Oh, goodness. The main thing about breaking the shields is... You need to do it in order, and you need to be very careful about how you do it. Because you need to basically separate... Well, you have a strong new Viet. More or less. I'll just join, and we can figure that out. Uh, well, it's a usable new Viet. What's your world level, by the way? Is it 8 or 9? Because 8 has about two-fifths the HP. Let's check. You got... Okay, just eight. Fair enough. I don't blame you. Okay. So I... I put in my Baiju for longevity purposes. Main thing is... I need to make sure that... I kind of swirl them in order. So basically, follow my lead. And when I take down when the shields are gone just start blasting so are you going for a specific achievement or just beating them at all period because those are two very different asks either way we got bajuan for the heals and this it's his world level eight it shouldn't be nearly as well. okay cool that can be arranged that can be easily arranged okay, i'm gonna wait till everyone gets their shields then yeah if you i got i just got to bring them all together not okay that's a good option there we go we got that so now i just gotta scroll fire oh well i guess 
If it's just about breaking them, that isn't so horrible. And we... Hmm, my goodness. This uh, power guy shield is... Basically, the trick for this fight is you really need them to all be broken at the same time. Generally. It's not a hard and fast rule, but it helps significantly. But... What I actually do is I use Nuviat's normals to get down most of the Pyro Shield to make it easiest to break all their shields at the same time. Let's see. Gaza should be able to help out here. And let's just get some healing in for you. Yeah, we'll just get Blooms. Blooms are always going to be somewhat good. It feels wrong for them to be this easily broken down. I kind of get the feeling that their shields aren't coming up as fast either. On the slower world levels, well, who knows really. And we'll scroll that. Okay, and oh goodness. The eye! They can be pretty scary. Yeah, I'm gonna get these heals in as best as I can. The main thing is, the one we should try to leave for last is the fire one. Pyro, because he's the only one who we really have a good ability to break. He's the only one whose shield we can break without great effort. Because of how finicky the Fitui shields are. So I'm going to... Well, give me a second. Should get his shield back shortly. But oh yeah, these, these guys are ridiculous on World Level 9. And I did all their achievements on World Level 9, which is... Honestly, more of a sort of... Admission of guilt than a brag. Okay, that got that. I oh goodness. Come on, come on. I we got to make sure we sort everyone at the same time if possible. So it's about grouping them up and worrying them together most of the time. So if you could come over by the pyro guy, we can group them up and hopefully break their shields. Well, give me a second. Thank you, thank you. Oh, but those shields are gone. Okay, well, all right then. We'll live. Thank you, thank you. I suppose, and well, if if necessary, it can be brute forced. But I, yeah, that's good. That's decent. Okay, well, okay. That will do it. As long as one of us stays alive, we'll be okay. Now that was the one we wanted to kill first. I will hold down the fort. If you want to go and try to obtain more healing, you can dip whenever. It's really no problem for me. You can go go to the statue and come back. I am not... I've got good healing. On world level 8, this is not a problem at all. Yeah, I, oh, goodness. Thank you. Oh, let's heal up real quick and go for another swirl. Oh, we got both of them. That's good. Okay, so let's get that shield in, and now they're both now they're both shieldless. Yes, oh, but oh, that shield broke as well. I need that. Come on, let's absorb that pyro, and that will break your shield. Thank you, there we go. That did work again. So if you'll just stay out of his way, he's gonna explode big time. And well, alright. Yeah. Wait and see if we'll hurt that warning a bit. And I, well, goodness. You know, I shouldn't have been that foolhardy either. All right, and Baju, get a delicious egg roll up for you. Gotta wait a bit for your healing to proc, and we got one left. Okay, okay. Take, take your time. Take your time, you can... I will be in your world until you rejoin your world. If you can come back, we can we can make this work. I'm still in your world. I don't think it'll kick me. I hope not. So, do your best to get back in here. I'm just healing myself up. Okay. I can just stay here healing myself up and surviving like an absolute leech. <laughs> Slowly burning this guy down too. And you can very tiny amounts of damage to his shield as well. Alright. Let's keep that burning up. Okay. Yep. Just burn yourself. Okay, okay. Take your time. 
I will do my best to whittle him down in your absence to make this as frictionless as possible a process. And I, oh, right, that did not hit you at all. You jumped back. Cannot overstate how much I hate this guy. I mean, all of them are painful, and I'm glad I don't have to fight them again, especially since they don't drop anything worth picking up, really. So I fight Sappho pretty much every day because the whistles are good. I want more whistles, but other than that, I'm not much else. As you can see, it's not fun breaking this shield without Hydro. But we should be good. Yeah. Come on, come on. I will keep this burning up as long as I must. Welcome back! Welcome back to the land of the living. And... Okay. In that case, I'll wait until the shield breaks. Go over here. Let Nuvia break that shield. And... I should absorb. No, it's still absorb power, but now he can break that shield, actually. Get some vaporizes in. I'll keep that power up. Keep vaporizing him. And well, well alright. Thank you. Uh, uh, and well, if it works, it works. There we are. Come on, come on. That's rolled Hydro that time. And that's all. Claim your reward. Nothing like a good Banju to be an absolute cockroach. Anything else you want help with? Otherwise, I do have one final fight with Ikuihapuili's Aegis to complete. Dodging a bunch of those attacks. Ah, okay, well, that is basically a job that I'll need to do on my own. Or... Diab Dia, or... You can just use Amber. The entire point is just... I need someone to apply... Pyro for me to vape with Milani. Because Milani is... Casio is basically a Milani check. And I have Milani. So I can pass the check. So... Generally for a bit of defense on my end, and Bennett would not help at all. The main thing is you want to limit the number of hits you have to deal. Which means that's why Milani's so good. She only deals a few hits. Just if there's an After I apply After I attack with Milani, I need you to reapply Hydro Pyro for the next attack. It's the only thing I need to do, and actually, Amber would be better, because Amber has no internal cooldown. It would work wonders. I think Amber would be the best option. Amber would be the best option. You don't even need to get close. You can stay away and just shoot at Casijo from the sidelines and avoid him completely. So I think, put in literally any Hydro character, and then Amber, just to apply Pyro. For me to vaporize. That's how we do this. That's how I beat Casio on World Level 9 in my own world. So I presume you'd like to do the honors of breaking all the Electro Crystals? I presume. Yeah, just any Hydro, and then pro preferably Amber. So she, because she has no internal cooldown. Also, this is going to sound kind of dumb, maybe, but... Other than applying Pyro with Amber, please do not attack at all. This is basically a Milani check. So if you could, if you could break all those Electro Crystals for me, get them to show up, we'll be chilling. Yeah, the only attack you should be doing are Pyro charge attacks. Well. Oh, wow. Okay. Do you want these Electro Crystals yourself? <laughs> okay, you should probably pick them up. They don't respawn. Once Casio is summoned, the Electro Crystals don't come back. Well, 
Koya actually wouldn't have because she has an internal cooldown and deals a bunch of hits. So you would probably have to deal multiple hits to get the pyro up going. Okay, there we go. Stay away as much as possible from Casio, please. You can take him out in the meantime. Oh, goodness. Goodness me. Well, good news is that those slimes don't come back. Okay. Just, I am going to keep my distance for now. Okay, so now it's Amber time. Now it's Amber time. Just go and have Amber just snipe. That is all I need you to do. Okay, and one, two, three, and... Yep, see? It's real good damage. And just shoot and we'll fight again. Yeah, just whenever you see Pyro disappear from him, just basically as soon as the bites come. So... For the next Milani, hit. Okay, and... Okay, cool. Just keep dealing charge attacks. Alright. Uh, okay, alright. And... Thank you. This should be alright. Okay, I will need a bit more Phlogiston. Just, we want to minimize the hits dealt. Minimize the amounts of hit I, hits I deal. And one, two, three, I... Oh my goodness, you are still crazy. I do not like this fight. I, come on, I shoot another so we can... Thank you. This is a tough one. And oh, well, that's death. Oops. Uh, give me a second to heal up then. Oh my goodness. Hasn't restored yet, so I'm going to boost Milani a bit, and I- oh my goodness. This is a tough one. It's a real tough one. Yeah, we're probably gonna need to actually break the shield, which is unfortunate. I'm gonna go to that statue, if you could hold down the fort real quick. Yeah, this... It's tough, and it honestly depends a bit on Witsith buff rolls. Okay, I'm coming back. Legitimately crazy fight. Okay. So once I... Oh, no. Oh, no. It's my turn. It's my turn to hold the fort down. Hello. Hello. Okay. All right. And... Music is not playing. Okay. You should switch back probably to... Avoid that. Well, that works too. Okay. Another shot. And... Thank you. Another. And come on, come on. Uh, Alright. Fight. Okay, cool. Alright, we gotta wait for Milani to get her stuff back. That's the thing. There's about a six second interval, which Milani can't really do her thing, frankly. And I. Uh, okay. Thanks. Nice. And. Uh, thanks. Okay. Oh my goodness. That went badly. Okay, and another fight. Okay, cool. And now the shield's up, which means... The best way to handle this is actually Tinati. So I'm going to put Tinati in and... Hold down the fort while I break the shield real quick. Hold down the fort, please. Okay. Thank you. I'm gonna switch in him. Just to break the shield. Okay. Uh, oh, okay, hello. Let's stay out of the way of that. I did not expect it to go that badly. Thank you. Lots of reactions. Hmm, annoying. Thank you. Thanks. And, oh, that broke it already. Well, and, where are you at? Oh, no! He got too far away. Oh, good lord. That sucked. Oh, goodness. Yeah, alright. Alright. There is a reason why he is the Nightmare, frankly. You need, quite frankly, you need a very specific team for this fight. I can heal back up and try again, but... The main thing is that for breaking his shield, for the achievement which is defeat him without proccing his shield, you honestly just want... The best way to do it is to go on a lower world level. 
Not kidding. If you join someone at a low world level, you can just annihilate him without much problem. Okay. Dia is an option too, but I don't presume you have Dia. Okay, thank you. For the shots, one, two, three, those are good options. Damage is good when it works, okay. Yep, not bad. I, oh, goodness. Thank you. I, oh, come on. I, well, that kind of worked. All right. Need some healing, I guess. All right. Thank you, and we'll put you in, and I... Ah, oh, wrong wits of buff. Okay. Come on up. Okay. Thank you, and another shot will do it. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're, we're doing okay. It's not bad. It's not amazing, but it's passable. Need to make sure we get you out of... Oh, and of course you're spinning now. This is awful. That spin attack is basically our greatest enemy. It prevents Milani from getting into hits because she's very melee oriented. Okay, I, we can jump that, which is nice. And, okay, cool. Okay, we can actually not so transmission that to keep the interval up a bit more consistently. Thank you, I. All right, and why are you gonna spin? I, okay, I, and I, oh my goodness. So we can get that down. I'm gonna go revive Milani again. The shield's coming soon, so I'm actually going to put Tianati in while I'm at the statue. To break that shield. Zhongli is not just there for defense, but also for the resistance shred. Yeah, he's here to... Tianati's rapid danger application is really, really good for breaking that shield. So we're getting him back in, back in play. Right. So I'm far away enough to not proc that shield. I oh well I oh it hadn't been proc yet. Okay. Right. Right. I mm, gotta go far away enough that the uh, health bar does not show because do not attack him in that state. It's a bad idea. And I come on. I uh, move faster than that homing. Annoying. Okay, cool, and I- oh my- you just zoomed at me, I hate that. Come on, I- come on, and how far away do I need to get? I hate this. Come on, stop, stop- what?! Good lord! Oh, you really need Milani for this. Also, just for getting away. Aw, oh, stupid, stupid. Okay, and let's just shoot- shoot- ah, let's break that shield, and that should do it, okay. We get back here and amber up. Should be good. Well, we could do some normal attacks, I suppose. Normal normals. I oh, and of course you're spinning now. Hate it here. Luckily, it's not like we need him for anything else now. Come on, come on. And all right, up. Shoot another. Thank you. Vapes are right here. Up. Okay. Oh, come on. Fight. All right, and we'll transmission to Milani. Oh, that's the yeah, boost. That's good. I, okay. I, oh, the damage there is not great. And I, this will do it. This will do it. And missile. And I, there we go. There's your normal kill on Casijo. You know, courtesy of yours truly. <sighs> it. It's a truly ridiculous fight. So did you pick up the Electro Crystals? Because I know drops replicate, but I'm not sure Ore does. Did you pick up? Okay, we can do that. Okay, well. I guess, if you don't mind, Electro Crystals is payment. Okay. I presume you have your own then. Okay. I'll figure out who I want to run. Hmm. Okay, good. Just checking. Let's go up. Thank you. And I... You got Chevy. I honest... No, no. Arlo's not good for this one because the overload causes issues. In that case, I will figure something out. I honestly, I think... 
Maybe Nuviat for mm. Hu Tao or something? I don't know. Uh -huh. Hmm. We'll figure out. Uh -huh. Got a keen H Vaunt. We could try a. If you've got an Animo, we could try a Nuviat team or something. Maybe. My Furina and Baju. That wouldn't hurt. Just battery your Nuviat. I wouldn't hate that. This maybe need a bit more energy and well it, it's not like Raiden's bad here. Okay. Mm -mm. Okay, cool. So I'll just put Fiorina down and continue getting up healing on the party. Okay, cool. And this one should also not be as bad. The lack of pyro is bad for the people, but that's okay. Come on, come on. Come on. And this is... Oh, I didn't even realize. We accidentally made a Hyper Bloom team. That's hilarious. Okay. I like that. Did you think about that? Because if so, you were a genius. Okay, and... Like this. He's applying that element. Okay, come on. Come on. Now this is... Actually, something approximating a team composition. And she'll take some huge fall damage, too. That's nice. And we'll try this again. Thank you. Oh, come on. I, where is she? I don't even see her. Where, oh, right, she was in the air. Nice. Okay. So juggling like this actually isn't bad at all. Okay. Thank you, and we'll try this out too. Stay out of the way of the spray can, but you know that already. Come on, come on. We'll keep blooming, yeah? Sometimes she just doesn't get knocked, and I wonder what determines that, really. Come on, come on. I... Uh, the short rotations are really throwing me for a loop here. That's okay, though. Yep, yep, yep. Come on. Bruce is definitely helping there. Right. Mm, get a bit of Electra there. The fall damage kill. Nice. We'll take some of those drops. And the drops are a little bit better on World Level 9, but I would never subject you to that. Is there anything else you need me to do? Otherwise, I'll fight a couple remaining local legends and I guess see the intro too. So you are smart. I like that. That was purposeful. All I thought was Felina and Baiju. But you were thinking, you were thinking hard. Also, Baiju gave a bit of a damage bonus to the Hyper Blooms, too. I'm not sure if you had that in mind, but if so, further kudos. Ah. Felina and a healer. Always a good option. Oh, okay, well, I'm not sure I can even... Can I go in with that? Hmm. If so... Because I'm not sure if it can even do Night Soul Totem challenges in multiplayer. Huh. Well, we can certainly give it a try. Come on. Come on. <clears throat> I... To get up there, I presume that Kinich would be the fastest way. Come on. Let's put him in briefly. Figure out which team to run. Because I'm pretty sure that you can't do nuts or challenges in a team. Let's check that out. I will validate that information. And... Gotta love the grapple. Okay. Is that for Kisten? Get up there, more or less. Well, it's actually over that way, and I'm stupid. Okay. And again, just zoom in. Thank you, and I, well, that didn't quite work as intended. Huh. Get up there. Come on, whoa. And drop it. Drop it. attack. Take that out again, drop it. Grapple. And drop it. Pull that up again. Okay, so the challenge is over there. Cool, cool. Okay. Nice. All right. Let me see. Yeah, I cannot interact with your Night Soul Totem. 
These are challenges that, for better or worse, must be faced by a lone warrior. Yeah. Because I, I still need to fight for myself, too. I haven't fought her yet. It's no problem at all if, in that case, I'm gonna go and do my fights. <sighs> that was fun. Glad I got to help you out, especially since it wasn't World Ball 9. Okay. See, I got one more date with Destiny with Iquahuipoe's Aegis. Which I think is going to have to be a Arua team production. And I bet the Arua team is going to be good on the other one as well. On Sihukuado, who I also have not fought yet. So Arla, Arla, and then Yai and Fischl. Right, Fischl's already in that team, and then Chevy. Cool. It's got to figure out how to burn those as best as possible. Amber is an option. Yeah, do Am option. Okay. Okay. Put in that team. Oh, that's an interesting idea. For the flavor, the main thing is that... Oh, you can use her grapples too? Wait. Wait. That's a crazy idea. Let me... I want to see what that does. Let's go back over to the totem. Hmm... Over here, and final one is just no hits taken. That should be fine. Okay. Land of decision. I need to check something real quick. I have a tiny bit of duel to do. I apologize. I was not able to do my duel and go earlier in the day, so I need to do one single lesson. Okay. Duel Lingo as always. It's not bad, but I don't have as much time for it as before. Okay. Dai Dokoro, kitchen. Okay. That's. Ex oh, okay, he can break them himself? Oh, that's. That's enticing. Either way, let's try Orla in here. Let's see. Hello there. Hello. Let's see how we can make this work. Just gotta dash out of the way that way. No. Yeah, I, oh my goodness, we messed that up already. We messed that up already. I hit it here. Okay. So we heal and try that again. Oh, we needed to iframe that a bit better. Heat my stupid Chungus life. Actually, I love my stupid Chungus life, but it's stupid. Oh, and, but applying that burn, then, is the question. Okay, and that one, yep, doesn't have the full aura yet. Try that challenge. Okay. Gotta make this work. This is probably my best pure damage team that doesn't have too many long periods of vulnerability, so... Right, and we can... Thank you, and... Do damage. Uh, okay, dodge out of the way of that. Cool, cool, and... We're just brute forcing this. Okay, and... Dodge out of the way, thank you. I- oh, what? That was bigger than I expected! What? Oh, come on. I- okay. That had a ring to it. This is- this is a crazy one, because it's about not getting hit at all. Not just about not taking damage, so a shielder won't do this for you. I love the challenge, but I'll be darned. It's spicy. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Get that there, and we'll set away that, and two, pull. Thank you. And one, two, three, four, and we'll dodge away the beam. One, two, three, four, and we'll try to get far, far away from that. I, okay, and what? Oh, it expands. I was not expecting that. Good, it's the first one expands outwards as well. I... Wow. Wonder what next patches is patches 
local legends are going to be like. Because I know there are going to be more. There are always more. The call always comes. And we'll do like that. So we don't get hit. And, I, well, it wasn't before the burst. There were issues with that. Okay, cool. Hmm, there are limitations to how well this will work. I, okay, well, hold on. Uh -huh. And we'll out of the way and just dodge out of the way of that. And I, okay, cool. Thank you. Well, we really needed that anyway, but still, I, okay, well, come on. Where is the fissure? Now that we've gotten one in, we can get that back at least. I, okay, I, all right. Hmm. I don't think we've taken any hits, but I really do not want to have to be uh, risking that and chancing that. Okay, cool. And that one's the crazy one. Okay, come on up. All right, I dodge. Okay. And no one's got damage on them, but I, Okay, cool. Let me just... have to do at least two to get back here, it seems. I, again, don't like that. Come on, I... Okay. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on. I, I hope that the iframes at first did not ruin this challenge for me because I... It's not giving me a lot of information, sadly. But I, okay, cool. Oh. I, I'm just running out of stamina. What is... Oh, nice. This challenge is actually ridiculous. The fact that... Honestly? Honestly. Some kind of Milani team would probably work well here. Just trying to think of who I'd put on it. Honestly, probably Zhongli, Dia, Shilinen. Shilinen would be good here. Would actually be good here, but it's all about those lengthy periods of vulnerability. I just had to kill a couple for Night Soul points, but I could. Well, Shilinen's there for healing, but still. I. Shio Res would also help. I really just. This is psyching me out. My goodness. Try this again because this is a crazy, crazy challenge. Okay. Cool. Put you in and we'll you in and in. Thank you and put that through and one, two and Milani, two, three. We'll see how much damage this seals and that's rather capable. I. Come on, come on. I. Mm. Shield. I'm not sure if that's. Counting is no it's taken. Because I uh, have some questions. And we'll, okay. Source sampler. Thank you, I. Let me just see. Check ends. Alright, we can go over some of those, but I, that's doing damage to me. What gives? I, I thought I've gotten that back. I, really? Whatever. Huh. Yikuhuipo is Aegis. Honestly, it... Something bow-related. Maybe a Winnie team, honestly, but... Just who do I... Who would I use? Who is mobile enough to actually avoid... Running into issues with... Legitimately crazy fight. It... Maybe Wanderer, just because he's high up enough. That could actually do the trick. <laughs> that could actually do the trick. It's funny though. So Farazan, Wanderer. Make sure Farazan's got the right bow. Quick swap team. Because it's not just about dodging, it's about dealing enough damage too. Favorite Wanderer team, Farazan, Yelan. Wander, because they're all grounded attacks. I want to see if they can actually be dodged. If Wanderer can just automatically dodge them. That would be the ideal situation. Masaka. Masaka. So I think Skyward still be the best option here. Maybe Woodsith, but I... One is inconsistent, more inconsistent than the other. Switch, you want the R5 one, I believe. Okay. Uh, this legitimately crazy. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try Kinich then. If it's that good. Don't get hit. 
Don't get hit. And roll. Thank you. Roll. And roll. Over there. Roll. Sell the way of that. Thank you. I. Right. Come on. Roll. And roll. Throw that out. Oh, okay. Cool. And just continue. This is a good single target team, but I think. Oh no, that. That still hits. It's got. That was not an option. Okay. I. Huh. Huh. That really freaks me out. So it's. Who is mobile enough? Does not stay in one place. Is not going to get severely messed up by. It might just have to be the newbie team. It's probably the newbie yet team again. I hate that. It all returns to Nuviet in the end. Hmm, probably focus on swirls rather than lengthy. Heals most of the time, then I... <sighs> going to have to be very, very hit and run. Huh, huh. Legitimately crazy fight. Okay, cool. And roll. Go over and roll. Just... Dodge out of the way that ends. Yep. Cool. Alright. Thank you. And just like that, we'll go back in and scroll again. We'll dodge your beam. Thank you for the heal. And we'll come on, come on up. Oh, please, please. Alright. Move out of the way and get another hit in. Now this definition of long haul. Okay. Cool. In exile to the land of decisions. Awesome! Awesome, just what I like to see. Okay, and we'll clean it up while we're in here, honestly, and go back out. Thank you. And there we go. Thank you. I dodge all the way that. And dodge all the way that. Cool. Uh, uh, I, thank you. We avoided that successfully. I. Oh, and of course that happens again. That's right. The intervals get longer as time goes on. I just really, really wish this wasn't the way these things are. What was the scam? And there we are. Cool. And one, two, three, four. And dodge out of the way. Thank you. And well, I uh, the blooms actually that worries me because that might be a problem. If I got hit. Okay. Oh, okay. To put, well, it's gotta have something eventually. I know there are lots of ideas like that, but. Come on, I, okay, I think I dodged that. Presume I dodged that. Okay, and really, really, whatever. Okay, come on. Come on. If a balloon counts as an attack, I am going to actually lose my mind. Okay, and screw over there. Thank you. Thank you. I... It's like this. If this doesn't work, I may just eat a baby or something. Okay, and... Cool. Damage is... Okay. Cool. Screw that. And we gotta put down you again. Dodge that. Cool. And... Thank you. Oh, okay. It... There's gotta be at least an achievement for that, though. Even if it's supposed to be quote-unquote a scam. Anything like that has something to it. Okay. I legitimately insane. It's just what is the team you're meant to use for this? And I away from that one. I oh, thank you. And we'll scroll over there and Oh, you're kidding. Okay, alright, alright. Alright, thanks, and get that over. Defeat as many as I can, put this down in the meantime, and we'll put in you and get back in here. Not so far. Cool, sufficient amount of curses, if you say so. Okay, and we'll do like that, and thanks. If it's no hits from the enemy, that's one thing. If it's no damage taken, period, that's another entirely. Okay, cool. I. Curse duration is not as. Oh, my lord! It's all for nothing. Ah, uh, die already. I... I'm gonna check to see what the requirements for that achievement are. Yukui... Pahili's Aegis... How do you spell that? 
Kahuipoi's Aegis attacks without being hit by attacks. Knights of Wars in the Dendro damage field do not count. But it's getting away from that is... What do you do? It... I feel like Keenage could be okay for this. It's just about seeing who I even have and... Who I have. I actually... That's a crazy idea. Maybe Fremine. Or some kind of freeze team. That can maybe stun them. That might have to be it. And that's Shinobu, Nahida. There's not a lot of healing on that team. Shinobu, Nahida. Xingqiao, Fremine. I just... This one's ridiculous. Legitimately ridiculous. Let's make sure everyone's got the right weapons on them. You got... Yeah, the right fab, right sacrificial. Okay, cool. Alright, alright. It's a better work. Cool. And that over there will make that work. Do a bit of dodging ends. Cool. Out of the way that ends. Thank you. Cool. Out of the way and we'll that done. We'll avoid the beam. Thank you. One, two, three, and up. Okay. Cool. One. Two, three, four, and thank you. One, two. Do I, I, I can't believe I got stuck. What? What gives? That was almost good. And the three additional hits from that are really good to me. But we gotta try that again. Stupid, stupid, stupid. So I tried to dodge around it, but it had too much. Stuff. Okay. So warriors. He's got a few killed. We can escape. I just really, really. I, what? The beam that time? What the hell? Really, really. I, okay. I, those are the bloom cores, but it's only attacks from the enemy from the boss. Shouldn't be all that much of a problem. Hopefully. Okay. That prevented that from moving. Interestingly enough. Well, I, not that back. You want to get this back. I really just hate this. Okay. Come on, come on. I... Okay. Uh, okay. Thanks. And let's try this again because this achievement is ridiculous. It's who can move? Who can move? It's hard to tell. You can afford to move. Thank you, and just like that. And we'll stay out of the way of the beam. Thank you. Cool. And we'll thanks. We'll freeze. One, two, and I, okay, dodge out of the way of that. And thank you. One, two. Oh, but I forgot to mm, right. Forgot to actually get the hyper wings up. Whatever. Oh wait. Thank you. And Dendro that I Thank you. That was weirdly timed. Okay, alright. Mm -hmm. Thank you, when can I go home? When can I go home? Okay, well, alright. Now I think we can go home. Okay. Cool, and just put away that. And what are you gonna do in the meantime? Yo, go over there, and can we... Really? Okay, I hate you so much. Thank you, and please that I... I forgot again. Okay, cool. I dodge. This is one of the craziest fights. Uh, thank you, I guess. Not really. Not really. Okay, I. It's like that. I, come on, when the decision. When the decision. Additional rings are what's really irking me here. And I. Well, I totally missed. You're kidding. You're kidding. Come on, let's get this back at least. I just do not like. How this is going. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, let's try this out. Can we click in that? We got healing in. And come on, come on. Should not have issues with damage though. But I gotta wait for a lot of these things to come back. Okay, if you'll take your time here, we can at least try to take a few more of you out with a spread or something. That's annoying. That's irritating. 
Okay, whatever. Okay, and we'll see what attack that's gonna be. Uh, okay, thanks. I hate you so much. Come on, come on. Aye. Thank you, I Beams out of the way, and we'll... Sheena Boo, thank you, I... Okay, don't... Oh, what? I couldn't dash? Go to hell. Go to hell. You need permafreeze for this. It's not working any other way. Okay. I, especially since it would prevent getting exiled, but I don't have any, I don't have anyone good for permafreeze. Permafreeze is literally just Ayaka. Well, it, I could try, I could try some kind of Fiorina Rathesley team. I think that's how it's going to have to be. Kind of Fiorina Rathesley. My goodness. The craziest Rookal Legend in the game. Honestly. It's not getting hit. It's plainly just need a permafreeze, but to do that. Serious help. And some got a healer. Shinha and heals, you know, Sigwin would actually manage. Probably. And Fiorina. Okay, the best way to do this is probably Furina. You, you, you. Okay, cool. That's Sigwin or Thesley on the same team. That's actually kind of cute. Okay, well. I just. Goodness. Don't even know what to say. What I want. What I do know what to say, which is this team is. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Okay. Come on, come on. I'm gonna kill those Saurians, though, sadly. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Yeah, that's our easiest way to and get stuff done. Gone. Just try to equip you again. Who hasn't gone to Shukawaddle? So we got all that blazing Fwinor. That was fun. Hmm. Okay. <sighs> Alright. See that pop in, but getting that name card is going to be crazy. Just some kind of functional permafreeze. It's going to be what I have to do here. Hmm. Permafreeze and functional are kind of not the same sentence. Hmm. Honestly. I feel like Yula would actually be good here because you could charge up a really strong lightful sword. You would need healing for her though, which easier said than done. Okay. Right. Cool. Scoured on you. What's Shen had got? Shen has got the wrong thing. Okay. Cool. All right. Thanks. I. What are you gonna send out at me? I thank you and what's we got there and well thank you. Well, thanks. Let's just permafreeze you and can we stab away that or can I? Mm -hmm. That does work kind of well. Okay. Well, it at least allows us to avoid getting attacked at all. Huh? I don't hate that. It's probably a good idea. It's gonna take a lot of brute force, but I should definitely try this out. Mm, lots of that. Lots of that. Okay, and there we are. Wait for this to come back. We don't have any curse right now. Okay. Hmm. Come on. I see quills, and I, that is not what we need to deal with at the moment. And now we can go back through real quick and. Cool. Permafreeze you and dodge that. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, just keep punching until punching no longer does the trick. And now this actually isn't even, even all that bad as a team comp. Okay, cool. Let's get some of this back in here. All right, okay, well, hold on. That hit someone, that hit someone. Let's wait for some of this to come back. And honestly, depending on how things go, it might be worth trying to... Get a few more curse stacks. Okay. 
Thank you. And all right, just like that. Thank you. And there we are. A couple of those. And actually, no, never mind. I, we want to freeze you. We want to freeze you as much as possible. Oh, and the talisman. That field did not quite do the trick, but as long as we freeze you to the point that you cannot attack, it will work. This will work. Well, okay. Finally, cryo usable again for something. Oh, and also sling it down helps if it freeze. That's right. Okay, so thank you. I right freeze again and we'll try that out. And there we go. Shatter and let's keep on punching. Keep on punching and we'll punch over there. It if it works, it works. If this works, it works. Again, it's a bit scuffed, but I managed to dodge that just in time. Okay. All right, that did not hit anything. Oops. All right, I'm just gonna make sure I get everything back. Uh, fault is gonna be in the middle of the arena. What you think about? Okay, cool. Just gotta make sure everyone's got a bit. Of, oh, that's annoying. Curse is not good. I. Okay. I. Thank you. I. I. Okay. Dodge. Dodge. Okay. I. We definitely got hit. That was a hit. That was a hit on me. Ah, and it, we're doing so well, too. It, I just got greedy. There are some things I need to put in. I need to put everything down before I leave the arena. That's the simple truth. Cannot afford to let leave anything up to chance. It's The only thing I might be able to do is the bubble bomb in arena. That... Jimmy insane. Okay, let's stand here. Some damage taken, and we'll just freeze you. We'll just freeze you. And there we are. Let's keep that freeze up. Okay, and right there. Thank you. And all right, let's see when we get that going. And all right, thank you. Permanently frozen. Permanently frozen. I what? Good lord! I Okay. This is really stupid. Okay. Thank you. And you need more of that. This is the only team. The only team that will work here at all, period. But still, a lot is left to chance, and you took some more damage. Awesome. Actually, it didn't take damage, but. Okay. This? Actually. Saying I thank you. Please, please. And just like this. You no, know, honestly, maybe some kind of freeze maybe that could work. But the cryo application without any kind of specific cryo character is hard to make work. You really want an on fielder to make cryo actually work strategically. Okay, cool. Now you over here, I suppose. Keep that freeze going for Arena. You should exile me shortly. Okay. Cool. Gotta understand when to dodge and go away, and well, there it is. Cool. We will try our best here to hit nothing. Okay. Cool, and just like that, we'll probably go back now. Yeah, alright, all right. we can get you in here, and this will more or less work. Okay. Yeah, okay. Make sure I have as much time seeing things as possible. It's only after they exile me can I honestly afford to dip. I need to be... Okay, that works. I will. Try this out then. Talisman Spirit. I... Okay, well. Alright, let's try this out. Just need a little bit over here, and there's our curse. Thank you, and go back in and charge you up, and we'll freeze you as well. Okay, what is that? That's another big. I hate you so much. Once that disappears, it's gonna just explode. I, okay, all right, and that temporarily broke that. I, okay, two, three, all right. This is. I can't afford to make a single mistake in the actual fight there. Dodge timing is annoyingly tough. When are you going to exile me again? 
the only time I can afford to really. The damage window. Okay, we're fine with that. Hopefully, I want to make the most use of this damage window. Okay, cool. And we can go in, freeze you. Cool. Make sure you do not on, on the other side of that beam. We saw a bit of a beam. Make sure we do not get beams. And cool. thanks. All right. Come on, beamer. So beam man. Okay, we just got a battery. And battery for Furina, that actually is not needed. I and out of the way, just keep on running. Okay, I is gonna take a number of instances. But you can kinda of run diagonally towards it and we're fine. I this is still just absolutely ludicrous. I guess that works too. I alright. And here we'll dash over and that Oh, it's barely out of reach. That's truly obnoxious. Get that going, kinda. And hit. Just gotta see what kind of attack you're going to do when that comes out. Okay, cool. Uh, you are actually evil. Come on. Come on. Your various attacks. Go ahead, exile me again. The only thing we can really do is wait for the exile. And... All these attacks are... You know, I've learned the pattern, but not fun. Okay, cool. We get as close to the center as possible. This is presumably good. And we'll go back from the land decision right into here. Where are you? Gotten frozen. Okay, cool. Thank you. Alright, and we'll try to figure out what to do next. What is your next move, mister? Equal we please we just gotta cannot afford to make a single mistake. And what's next? You okay? Alright. Thanks. Just three more times in X zone, we should be okay. Alright. As far away from that as possible. Andrew Shockwave, and there we go. Cool. Alright, alright. And Thank you. Thank you. And we got one stack. Okay, I set the way of your beam. Now that was actually a really annoying attack to come back to. I'm gonna keep spinning around and I uh, keep repositioning myself to behind for when he actually gets a hit. Okay, cool. And guess we can shatter. Luckily, the position wasn't actually all that bad. Your turning speed isn't all that high. Okay, I. Someone who's fast, actually fast, keep getting away. Okay, it's for fun, let's freeze you. Go ahead, excel me the land of decision. This is legitimately evil. Thank you, and that's a bit closer there. And I, you know what, let's get that over there, just get that up as soon as possible. Will you freeze? Will you freeze? Let's get on the other side, because that looks like beam. I legitimately hold this in fear. Okay, luckily well, we were able to get around the other side. And when are you gonna exile me? We'll just keep running. Up. Oh goodness. Out of the way. And out of the way. Cool. Should exile me again soon. Or not. Or not. Annoying attack. There we go. Cool. It's so around the center. Come on, this should be the last one we need. And there we go. Well, you know what? Let's actually just take some down with Sigrun. Just to see. And we'll go in. Go in. Freeze, if all possible. And that was nearly the end of things. Oh my goodness. Let's do it. Let's do it. And moment of truth. Moment of truth. And thank the good lord in heaven. No more of this garbage. Ah, <sighs> no, no hit, Ikahuipoes, Aegis. That, it's time for Sequadal. I just, my lord. The thing's expected of me. Well, that, did he get all three of her achievements? Because without getting hit by any attacks. If you did that with Keenich, I commend you. Okay, well. 
Yeah, that name card is for crazy people. But that name card is coming soon. Okay, so I'm gonna see. And you said that we'd I'd be able to actually break her grapple points by grappling to them myself. If so, that's real cool. So I'm gonna put in my Kinich team then. And I usually run, which is just like that. Okay. And there is no garbage with not getting hit for this one. It's just good plain old, can you kill her? Can you kill her? Okay. So then I'm just gonna get Bennett's burst back up. Because it's basically one of the achievements is defeat her, one of the achievements is defeat her in a hovering state. The other is defeat her before she can grapple. I'm wondering how that's going to work if we grapple ourselves. Okay. This? Oh my goodness. Downright hardcore. Yeah, it... Without permafreeze and even with permafreeze... I mean, very plainly, a lot like Tristars, it's kind of an Ayaka check. Kind of, and again... Ayaka is one of the six characters, period, that I don't have. There are more characters I haven't built, but Ayaka is one of the six characters I don't have. Don't have Ito, Ayato, Kokomi, Ayaka, Kui, and Nilu. And we'll do that. Go up again, and... You can actually get four of those Aha grabs, actually. You drop off, do his mid-air attack, you can get another grab, and you can do another grapple. Do another grab, and unless... That messed up. That did not work. Okay, let's try that again. And Wait, that didn't work either? Oh my goodness. It's finicky. You can get a lot of crazy climbing if you do things right. And, uh... What? I guess it's about how much you travel before the grab procs. Or the ledge grab procs. Let's just see. And, uh... There we go. Uh, there we are. Drop off and sort of aim that perpendicularly. Okay, that worked a lot better. Okay, now we've gotten a lot of the way up. Having to deal with a lot of that. Not, okay, because we can't do any more grabs there. So we touch ground again. But that that's good for climbing. Said honestly, honestly, Shulin would be better, but we also don't have Shulin in right now. We don't have Shulin in right. Shulin in right now. Another dumb little pawn. Okay, and that directional change was fun. So see, get Ranger Colonel, Candle Cap Mushroom, no spores though. We're almost to that word of the night. It's exciting. Trial Precision. During this trial, opponents will leap into the air using grappling hooks, break the objects the ropes are grappled onto to cause your foes to fall back down. Ah, okay. Sigur Guado, come back from once, walk, walk with the word of Shababa. Okay, and let's see, we can break that. Can I break that? Let me see. I. Oh no. Aw. Let's see. Get on there, but. Mm, no, you need some kind of fire. Well, we can still try beating her this way, I suppose. She keeps moving around. Yeah, um, you know what? In honor of you, I'm gonna try that Keenich team. But it does not. Oh, but if you get burning on her, you'll. Burn it up yourself, right? Okay. I, well, okay. That kind of works. I, is that burning going? Thank you. Yeah, but I think Arla team is some other way to keep her from actually getting up in the first place. It would be better. We'll see. All right, there we go. And come on, you want to come back, don't you? I, come on, come on. Mm, that's not quite as well as I'd like. Come on, just. This down, and we need you again, and if we can keep burning in on you, we can burning in on the other grapple points. It's just a normal fight. It's a normal fight. Okay, cool. Very mobile. Okay, so are you going to go on any of the others? Or? Yeah, you will. Okay. Alright, well, we can try this out. Oh, what? Never mind, you're kidding. Come on. That was kind of ridiculous. Oh, different, different, different one. Okay, I hate you. I hate you. Come on, come on. Uh, really? And 
What? What? Really? Okay. I'm gonna keep shooting. All right. Well, that. No more healing, but it's burning now, which is good. And, oh, he's dead again. Not great. That's got fire on there. The fire is not going to be you. Okay, let's try that end. Burning on their end. Well. Aw. Oh, I. It seems like they come back. Yeah, Kinich might not cut it here. Amber can actually burn those down pretty well. Hmm. To shoot those with Shavros is an idea. I think the Arla team have to do it. There's also one where you hit while grappling. Also something to think about. Pruning is an eye. Also you can put Amber in to just burn them down. That's still kind of silly. I want to see whether Yai and Fish will target grapple points. Either way, Chevy should be good at actually shooting yeah, them down, hopefully. Do we'll see. But, I don't know. I don't know. Probably need to reset a bit. Well, I... That's just for healing. Okay. Come on, come on. Yeah, but that was all I needed there. And, well, you, okay. Oh, so you, to actually keep her from grappling, it's probably more permafreeze. Oh, my goodness. In the end, it all returns to permafreeze. I, good lord. Maybe, I don't know, using overload to keep her stunned, maybe? Let's see, and we'll put that down and see how this works. I, right, come on, I, all right, and... Shoot over there. I right, come on. Come on. No, never mind. That didn't quite work. Okay, and that's way too high up to actually shoot down. Oh well. Oh well then. Ah, ah. Try this again, but I'm gonna keep shooting at me. I think it's definitely amber. Because it's burning now. It should disappear eventually. Yay, okay. Ah. But to... Before... Before she grapples. Beat her before she grapples at all is a tall order. Hmm. Well, they're all broken now. Whatever as real as that probably means. And we'll shoot twice. Okay, and shoot again. That good damage. Okay, well, that also hurt me, which is not fun. I uh, keep moving and I, oh my goodness. When are you spinning and how and okay? Let's just get the healing back at least and I How will I keep you from actually managing that then? Alright, shoot and shoot, thank you. And one, two, I see out of the way of that. I, this is still an interesting puzzle. Honestly, it, all of these are tough and I, of course you're up there. I hate you so much. Come on, and we can at least Try to stay in place, maybe, kinda, and... Shavros is shovey, shovey, and will that break you down? That will make you fall. Stun you briefly. Okay. Actually, this is... Yeah, it's actually just a good team for this purpose. I like that, and we'll use that to get a bit of healing in on you. That's not a problem at all. And I, okay. Official. And just that over there, thank you. Blast, blast. Come on. Keep on. Oh, well. Go ahead, hit me. Damage of this team is just really good, though. So, Guadal, look at bone. It's the first achievement. Alright. Okay. It's the first one. Only two more. I don't think I'll be doing any Archon quests today. Tomorrow, though. Okay. Duelist, defeat local legend. Sifu Guadal, look at bone. During the course of completing a single challenge, break all the grappling anchor points before the Sifu Kawadal of Kamerik Bone goes into the hovering state. I... Gonna take a really weird team for that. I... Honestly... Petrify... Some kind of way to get maybe a swirl in? Electro swirl to have Kaza destroy the grapple points? Before it goes in. But you only have to do it once. I'm just gonna... Some kind of... T 
team for that would probably be someone to keep her stunned. Zhang Wei for the stun. Probably Corinne's for a swirl or something. Nahida. And then Kaza. Just just uh Nani but how am I going to ensure? Hmm. Legitimately kind of intimidating. Huh. Okay. Cool, I guess. I will get that through and... Okay, cool. Thank you, and cool. Thank you, I uh, will get that going and hope that I... Okay, cool. I and... No, that was done badly and it doesn't even hit that. You can't hit that. Okay. Not well, at least. Huh, okay, well, it was an idea. How am I going to keep it still, though? Hmm. That is rather confusing. Some kind of... <sighs> trap them. Get them all... Just petrify them and get everything burning. I... In that case... Maybe some kind of Lenny team with... Dia instead of Zhongli. Huh. That's, again, legitimately wild that I have to go to. I like that it is a team building puzzle. I was not expecting it to be this much of a team building puzzle. Okay, cool. Alright. Okay. Thank you. Put your stuff down. And we'll hit you. Thank you. And I, well, they're not there yet. Okay, cool. And we messed that up. Cool. And will you? That will not stop you. Okay. Hmm. What's well? All right. That. How, how do you do that? How do you do that? See what Kawad will come Eric Bone Hover. See what Kawad will come Eric Bone Two. Do that in a single period where she's hanging. Oh, wait, what? Huh? So they're straight up giving incorrect information. As in, it's not before she goes into the hovering state, it's before you knock her down. Break all the grappling anchor points before you knock her out of the hovering state. That... So I didn't have to deal with all that garbage. Okay. So Arla team's still gonna be good for this. Presumably. Have to make sure the one that I'm breaking is not the one she's on. Okay. Alright. Cool. Alright then. We'll just keep on going. And thank you. Um, shoot. And which one are you gonna grapple to? That one. So go over there. Alright. Cool. Keep doing your silly little thing. I'm gonna go over and... Oh, the burning is incomplete. Okay. And make sure the ones we burn are not the ones you... Okay. That cannot hit that high. All right, and... Of course, of a single challenge. It's not gone yet. And can I... Shoot. Still took that hit. That's fine. Gonna grapple over, or... That burning will deplete most of it, but not all of it, and there we go, I- Wait, wait, oh, I- I don't think that did the trick. I- Apparently you really just need Amber. Or Winnie. You can make Winnie work. Honestly, then, I- Kaz is okay. It might be Shionem, honestly. Killing's a bit better. She went in for. What would need to revive Winnie is the thing. Now, a Winnie team would actually probably be good here. Pyro Bow that isn't. Well, the Oimia team would also work. That is true. And it's also got. You know what? The Oimia has had a long time in retirement. She can come back. 
She will do the job here. I don't want to have to revive Lenny for this. Okay, cool. There we go. Do you want me to wrap up the target? Or we'll squeeze the target? Alright, cool. Let's so actually just get all of my energy back. And... Cool. I'll wait for those cooldowns and... Alright. Especially since she is mobile, so being able to stay away is good. Okay. Let's retry this. Gotta hit the right one. Okay. Break the objects. Break the grapple points. Thank you. Thanks. Go ahead and grapple. Which one are you gonna grapple to? That one. Okay, cool. And we'll just stay in. Oh, my goodness. Lack of a source of healing is not good for that. Come on. I said strafing is actually doing well. And I, well, I actually did not want that. That was a bad idea. Oops. In that case, maybe the Lenny team might be better, because at least I can heal better. It was built in healing in that team. I said, I wonder, I don't imagine Kazu would actually be the best option. I feel like Shield in it would work better. It's got healing, bonus, and shred. Let's just heal him up. This is a lot more complicated than I ever expected it to be. Huh, well, we, we just need to manage it once, and then defeat her. Okay. But there are problems here. We'll figure this out, and we'll take that going, and... When are you gonna do it? When are you gonna do it? We'll... Thank you. I well, we missed that time. Okay, and... Shoot. Get one in. Thank you. And make sure that keeps on going. How long is that going to keep grappling for? And that should stop and... Oh my goodness. So in that case, actually, should focus on breaking the one she's actually on. Okay. Because eventually she'll grapple off of it. Okay. That order can hopefully make sure. And then after that it is, I suppose, kind of luck-based. She'll grapple away in time to get away from that. So hopefully, if we make that work, we can ensure that... Well, that's actually perfect. Kinda? Maybe. I guess not. Hmm, but the timing on that is actually kind of ill. And this should break that down right properly. Yeah, so I guess the wiki is just wrong about the conditions. It's good because those conditions are ridiculous. And we'll keep on shooting and we'll hope we stay far away enough from you. Okay, yeah, we'll... Mm, this should work. And there we are. Cool. Damage oh, there does leave a bit to be desired, I will say. Come on, come on. Oh, let's do this. And if it knock you up, it won't knock you up, sadly. Oh well. Alright. And no virgins from that, sadly. Alright, and we'll just keep on shooting and no more shield, unfortunately. I there we go. Cool. Let's break these as quickly as I can. I miss. Okay, cool. Thanks. And just strafe. Alright, cool. Okay then. Shouldn't be too bad. Hit the first one, then the one she's on, and it's well, there we go. We've fallen. Alright. Not a lot of healing in this situation, sadly. And there we go. Kinda. Need a better refine, frankly. Oh well. And keep on shooting. Luckily, it seems like we're actually managing to stagger, which is rather pleasant. And what's actually otherwise? Yeah, honestly. Again, the team weaves a bit to be desired, and Sack is what we want for a team with multiple Hydra anyway. We'll be okay, can we? Thank you, and that broke the shield. Not great. I, okay, can I shoot you down here, or can I... Can I ah, oh, we gotta stay on the move. I don't like that. We do have problems here, and shoot. 
shoot. I just gotta make sure I don't die. That's the thing. Hmm. What's Fiji going here? Ah. Thank you. Eventually it'll burn down. Like all of them before you fall. And there we go. Because yeah, I don't think it's even possible to break things down before. Break them before she goes up at all. Way too much speed issue there. Okay, cool. Yeah, I sack sword would be better here. I mean, we're waving, but it's not an ideal situation by any means. Okay, and well. Petrify, cool. Nice, good that they let you do that at least. Thank you, and cool. Go on, go on. Come on, and we just need this. Well, we need to put the shield back down. Okay, and we. Okay, well, alright. Thank you, I. Thanks, I. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Okay, cool, and we jet it over to the other side, and I can dodge that at least. Okay, cool. Okay, you actually have a, If you're directly under, it's a blind spot. Okay. Ah, okay. Now let's see. That's the trick. If you're under there, she just can't hit you at all. Uh -huh, okay. This... She's really rather crazy. Okay, well, all those will disappear. And yep, lighting them on fire is... Definitely the most competitive strategy here. Come on, give me that. Uh, fab. Thank you, and. Alright. Probably gonna need another shield up. We can do that. Okay, and. Well, you wanna get it? Thank you, and. I will trigger reverse rocks, which we haven't been able to do for some time. That's actually a meaningful damage increase. Nice. And that should kill, and. There we go, we got that achievement, which is literally incorrectly described. So one more attempt, we will finish off all of her achievements and get that name card too. It's fun, I suppose. This one is about taking her down when she's in the hovering state. Break all the grappling points before she goes into hovering state, but it's no, it's break all of them before knocking her out of the hovering state. Defeat the Suquadal Kamerkman while she is in the hovering state. That would be one e team business. Just because the Lenny team is going to be better, too. Okay. So that. Then Shulanen and her Center City set. Then Dia and Bennett. That should be more than good enough. Okay. Oh, but Lenny's dead. That's right. Oops. Let's heal him up. I've had to use healing food more times than ever before. Okay. And that should be more than good. Okay, try this. And there we are. Let's start off over there and actually get that that's a transmission going. Got those going and we... Just a couple of those. Thank you, I. Come on, come on. Ah, okay. Luckily, we can actually hit her over there. Then I can go in and shoot and try that. I, we need to keep burning these. Thank you. Defeat her while she's in the hovering state. Eventually, it does keep me away, which is nice. Come on, come on. Get away from you. Come on, then. This ain't half bad, honestly. That breaks you down. And there we go. And she went in. Come on, and we can get the healing in. We may as well. Okay, and. Oh, but then it's energy. It's a bit of an issue. Get her prop arrows in and stay away from you. Burning is kind of annoying, but we'll be okay. And pull you up and blast there. Okay, nice. Just see what this requires. Oh, we got burning on us now. I don't like that. Thank you. And I, okay, cool. Thank you. Get that shred in. And I, mm, we have some issues here like that. And I, okay, cool. It's not a bad team. Not a bad team at all. I, well, that missed. That did miss. Okay, can I hit- No, 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 I- Okay. Stupid, stupid. That is not even bringing that all that well. It's got some AoE, but... Emphasis on some. You're burning a bit. Just a little. Hmm. In that hovering state. 
is an interesting idea. Cool, and we can slice that, get that going, and that will help out viewing some of you individuals. And I, okay, well, all right, I, okay, got it over there, and you get your crop arrow stacks in, good damage. And I, okay, well, and interruption resistance was not up to par, but we can, well, all right, come on. Uh, this is aggravating. Come on. Thank you, and whoa. We've got all those bursts in. Now we can start shooting. Thank you, we go over here and then. Shoot if at all possible. Get that burning going. I, I managed to burn that. I did not manage to burn that. I, okay. Come on, come on. Make sure you don't hit me too hard. Let's get the white ones. See where you're going and going over there. Let's approach. It really is an absolute hall of a fight. Okay, and heal. Why not end? That night's old transmission was a bit bothersome, so thank you. A few more hits, and we'll dodge. Kinda try to dodge, and we'll go over. We still have to hop out to actually do that, and we'll go over there for the battery, and she went in. Well, Thank you, nice. Straight that, and we'll bend it. Thank you, and energy is a bit of an issue there. Come on, come on. And just like that, we'll burst over there, and now you're doing your thing. I, thanks, just gotta dodge that, and I can shoot the others while you're underneath, and there we go, we got yours in. Let's see on here. This? She's strong. She's real tough. And that broke, and the delay on that was actually hilarious. That was some legit Looney Tunes stuff in there. She grapples over, hovers in the air for just a second, and then realizes that there was nothing she was clinging onto. That, that's insane. Okay, and let's pass this and make sure we can... One more go should be okay. Thank you, and yeah, and yeah. Gotta make sure we kill while she's hovering. Thank you, and... Thank you. Another. I, oh, I have my reservations about this then. Hmm. That's some trouble, I suppose. Okay. Hmm. Burn all these down. I'm gonna do just enough damage so I can shoot her while she's hovering next time. That's very interesting conceptually. Be very careful about how much damage I deal. Okay, and now you're fallen. Cool, alright, and. Dia. Bennett, sure, and there we go, cool. And we will damage you. Good deal. Just make sure this crits aren't too crazy, and that did good damage, which means hopefully we can get those hits in. Probably put down. Then it's burst, and then... Okay, when you grapple, we can try to get this shred going. Come on. Then just shoot a few times. Yep, this should be a good time. You should grapple now. Thank you. We will go ahead and shoot you. And another should be the trick. And... Come on up. Well, all right. Never mind. And there we go. Is that enough? Oh, come on. You've got to be kidding. Let's see if we can hit you like this, and... Okay. Blade Roller, Blade Roller, without hit. Blade Roller's got a hit. I... What? Okay. Let Dia do it. Come on. This Winnie Death is actually evil. Come on. I... Shoot. I... In the middle of her grapple, too! And that's the final achievement. We're free. <sighs> okay. So in that case, I'm going to collect that name card, which I earned for sure. It's some impressive Looney Tunes stuff. Okay. Allow me to collect that achievement. Duel Series 1, defeat the Tsuhoku Adol of Kamek Boom while she's in the hovering state. It's all of these. Achievement Lord of the Night. How can restless thoughts be calmed in this land? The only way is battle. And we can look 
at our achievements, which here represents itself as all six pillars available. Oh, last version, therefore this version went up. Look out in the distance, and you can see one, two, three, four, five no longer went up, and probably that over there is a little similar to the Chamber of Night's Trial, which is a Night Soul version of the Night Kingdom version of the Stadium of Sacred Flame Slames. But it's its own thing. Mm -hmm. Whatever is in there, which presumably is the Lord of Night themselves. I presume that once we get all those other totems fully lit up, or at least lit up a little. I imagine that you can fight them once you've gotten every basic achievement. I wonder what kind of special reward there might be for getting every single one. So you look over here and that's it's glowing like the totems are. You go over there and the light isn't as high and it's not highlighted in blue. Not highlighted in blue. And, oh, I did not mean to set that. I'm leaving that set. That is a... That's an achievement. Let's see. Everyone's got. Okay. Another Kingish player over there. That's crazy. So in that case, I guess I'm leaving the Night Kingdom. Because that is actually insane. Oh my goodness. Wow. So we got a whole of these lit up. That... No Archon quest today, but that did go longer than I intended. But it's all those achievements, and I also got to we got to help out a couple of people. That was nice. Also, it was nice having Shulin and on the team for that one. So I guess that will be all for today. My goodness. So I'll see you in about. 11 hours, possibly. Maybe. Who knows? Okay. So again, thank you for watching. It went on for longer than expected and started later than expected. Thank you, Job. But that was fun. Yeah, Sandragon. See you around.